Hello. Me. Welcome. My stream. How are you guys doing? Tridian, Shinobi, RGR, Cade, Dylan, Yardy Cry. Yardy Cry, again. Tridian, make up your mind, mate. Either we stop uploading or you miss the Bloodborne content and you would like us to continue uploading. Make up your fucking mind, dude. No problem, Cade. That's what the walkthroughs were useful for. I know Shinobi. I know, mate. It's been a while. It's been it's been a while. But you, you can stop. You can stop begging. You can stop begging your family to let me to let you to let you watch my stream. You can stop begging now, Shinobi, mate, because you're back. Your family loves you. You love your family. At least you do now. And everybody, everybody, everything's cool. Everybody loves your dog as well. So that's pretty good. Shut up, Hillary. Uh, yes, you were saddy. I will um, remind you, Trump, because you probably don't remember much. But um, Sandy, San, fucking Sundays, guys. Fucking Sunday is my day off. Sunday is my day off. All right, Shinobi. So shut, no, shut, shut up. <laughs> Just shut up, guys. It's too confusing to talk to all you people. Okay, it's too confusing. Exactly, Shinobi. They just have to accept it. They can follow whoever they want. Like, you, you, they can follow whoever you want. But you, you, you know, they're just gonna have to accept your path, the path of the Shinobi. You know what I mean? It's not. It's Saturday, not Sunday. But yeah. Shadows. Like we are on shadows. Uh, we've only had two attempts on shadows so far. I think we had two or three attempts on shadows before we left, but we haven't really had many attempts on shadows. So. I'm not sure if they're hard yet or not. Uh, yes, I know you're not allowed to fist. You're not allowed to. You're not actually allowed to do any uh, visual or um, attacks like this. But we said we will do um, for uh, for getting some thingies, just to not torch the pig to death. Hello, Robert. How are you doing today? Thank you for the uh, sub, Jose. Appreciate it, appreciate it. The blob is nearly down. The blob is on how much? 100 HP. Next sub takes the boss, who will be the big boy sub. Do, 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 do. Shut up, here. Uh, um, we will, we will try the DLC. Like once we finish the vanilla game, I'll call it a successful run. But I'm, I think we will try the DLC. Like we'll at least give it a try. Like, but I don't guarantee that we, um, that we finish it, though. You made up your mind, stop uploading. Thank God. I think you're right, Trudy, mate. I think that's what we, we'll go with here. We'll just take notice of you and just stop fucking uploading, okay? Well done, Trudy, mate. I'm proud of you, dude. Thanks for helping me take the hardest opinions in life. Jesus Christ. That went down quickly. Why am I reading these fucking chat messages, which are ten days long, about a dark room with a gorilla in it? What the fuck am I doing when I'm supposed to be concentrating on this? God damn it. God damn it, Robert. We don't have time for the gorillas in the dark rooms right now. We've got some busy shit. This is actually, this boss is going to be hell. I think um, Ethan was right. <laughs> I think Ethan was pretty right. Not lost my mind. I'm still, I'm still good. I'm still the cool motherfucker I was and always will be. Just poking the poke, poking the poke. Just don't need to be reading chat messages right now to kill these motherfuckers. Because there's three of them. I'm not sure if you guys are aware of this, but there are three of them, and there is one of me, and the one of me only has a little torch, and that is not a good idea to be reading chat at the same time as trying to do this. Luckily, we have unlocked the, um... No, Shinobi, thank you, mate. See, see now, they're, they're the type of chat messages that I can be reading in the middle of battle. The, the praise the sun motherfuckers won. Okay. It was worth it, though. Thank you, Shinobi, for the two pounds. And I praised the sun at the same time. See, they're, they're the chat messages I don't mind reading. How you doing, Todd? How you doing, Todd? You know, Todd. Thank you, Shinobi. Appreciate it. Appreciate it, boy. Appreciate it. Even if that, you know, even if, even if, oh, never mind. I was gonna say, like, even if freezing the sun was, would have killed me. You know I like them cheesy boss steals. 
the cheesy boss still. To be honest, I didn't actually get to read the message. I'm not gonna lie. I just re I just heard the message. Thank you so much, Shinobi. You know, we're dead. Doesn't matter though. We're not. We're not. We're not taking any of these cheesy boss steals because it's gonna take a fucking long time. Bloodborne, great game, but can I have my Smash controller back? <laughs> I don't. I don't. I don't think you're lying, Todd. I don't think you're lying. Smashing controller. To be honest, I've never broke a controller pad uh, on a Bloodborne or Dark Souls game. I mean, I think I broke an analog stick on Blood on Dark Souls 3. But not because I was pissed off, just because I played it so much. And I think the, the, the analog stick kind of got worn out. Let's just praise the new battle. It was worth it, mate. Shut the fuck up. Yo, Nugget, what's up, dude? What's up, Nugget? How's the nugget doing today? I need to go and farm. Luckily, we did unlock the um the best place to farm in this game. So it's not Smash, but there's a problem with the left trigger. <laughs> that's not that's probably not good. Left trigger, the only button we can um the only button. Oh wait, no way. All oh, right, no, no way. Did we not? I'm pretty sure we unlocked a. Sh uh, Wait, I'm like a hundred percent. We activated the other. Surely we did, didn't we? I got a bad feeling that we didn't. I got a bad feeling that we just. No way, sure. Yeah, we did. What the fuck? How do you go to the other one then? What's the other one not unlocked? I don't know. Maybe I'm just blind. Do 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 do. Uh, I, yeah, we're doing optional bosses. So far, we have done all the optional bosses. So yeah, we will. We'll try. Like I said, I'm not guaranteed anything optional, but I will try. Um, buy a new one for 4.99. Sounds like a great idea. Yo, Nick, Sekiro has no ragdoll effect. Oh, really? That sucks. Get a ragdoll effect. I'm sure we'll still all buy it. I don't think anybody's gonna walk in and say, "Nah, no ragdoll effects. Thanks. Don't want that game." And wait, did I just use the complete wrong item? Am I supposed to use the hunter's mask since we don't really have any souls? Playing cleric, cleric here in Dosis I'm trying to get blessed gem. Cleric, is cleric who? What weapon does a cleric start with? Is that the one that starts with the mace or the um, or the? No, I think, I think it's the herald that starts with the pokey pokey weapon, right? That was a nightmare as well. Pokey fucking herald, god, that was hard. Like doing Herald without leveling up was a nightmare. Every time you press R2, my character starts walking forwards. That probably isn't good in a game like Dark Souls, not gonna lie. Uh, actually, on I think it's the, yeah, this controller pad I'm using now, the R2 button is slightly uh, broke. Uh, on Dark Souls and st in games like this, it doesn't, it's not noticeable. But on games where you have to press it all the way down, uh, it doesn't work. Like, it's only got a really small travel on this R2 button. So like basically on all car games or racing games, this controller pad is useless. Mason Chime, hmm. Some say Cossum. Still don't understand the people. Like, like, I'm not sure if anybody in this chat calls him Cossum, but I just don't understand that pe the, those people. I just don't understand the Cossumers. And like, you would obviously call him Cos. Nobody calls him Cossum. I think the people that call them Cossum are just a little bit cray cray. Yeah, I know. Uh, Sekiro looks okay. Still no rug though effect, so nobody's gonna buy it though, I don't think. Alright, let's get a few more of these. There's like free farms. But the spells suck. I don't to be honest, I'm not even sure what spells they start with. How you trying to know Dodge Run? Um like as in you can you have to walk and run around everything? No, I haven't tried that. I was going to try it at one point though. Looks interesting. But the thing is I know that I, I, I would have to remap the buttons so I don't so I wouldn't accidentally roll because like I roll so much. Because I don't use a shield. And like, I literally rely on rolling or dodging all the time, so it's gonna be really hard. Yo boss Vivo. Vivo Vido Vivo. Adam, how are you doing? William Wilma even. No present circle would be a cool run. No, yeah, like, it would be a cool run, but I'd just have to remap the uh, buttons, I think, because if not, I'd just accidentally press it. Favorite Dark Souls Remastered boss? Probably be the same boss as my favorite Dark Souls Normal boss, right? 
I don't know which one that would be though. Maybe Artorius. Probably Artorius to be honest. Take it out too easy, obviously. Nobody says Cosm. Yeah, like I, I've seen a bit of gameplay of Sekido and it looks a bit. It's not Dark Souls. It looks a bit like Neo mixed with Dark Souls, even though Neo's already. I don't know. Maybe even Tenchu mixed with Dark Souls. Not sure. No problem, Wilma. That's what the videos were there back in the day, anyway. Dark Souls Remaster is kind of sort of not really good. I already said this, like, it depends, because if you've never played Dark Souls 1, then it's a good game. But if you play Dark Souls 1, I'm not sure if it's really worth it or not. It's like the other day here in Spain, somebody did a review on the Dark Souls trilogy, and it was like, it's not worth it. It's like, how the fuck can you say it's not worth it? Like on the remaster, fair enough. But on a trilogy, like, mate, I don't even know how you can do reviews of trilogies. It's basically saying, like, if you're saying that a trilogy is not worth it, it's basically saying that Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3 are shit. It's obviously not worth it if you've already got the games, because it's like saying uh, Dark Souls um, 2 is shit if you've already got Dark Souls 2. It's like no fucking shit, mate. Like, the trilogy is clearly for people that have never played those games. It's like, I just don't understand how people can do a review on a trilogy. It's like, nah, it's not worth it. It's like, it's clearly worth it if you've not played the games. It's clearly not worth it if you've already got the games. Because then no game would be worth it if you already fucking got the games. You dumb fuck. Yo, James, what's up? What's this run about? Oh, okay, T7, mate. Is that how we're, is that how we're saying hi today, T7? Is that, is that poor little Shinobi just took the blob? Just, just like that. And then fucking T7 comes bullying in with his glass of milk. It's like, hold my milk, guys. Donates 15 fucking dollars just like that. Thank you for the milk, mate. Thank you for the uh, milk and the 15 dollars. Oh, you're, you're doing farm work. Is that is that what you're... Is that is that how you're saving your money these days? Doing farm work. <laughs> okay, mate. Take care of yourself. Thanks ever so much for the donation, dude. You didn't have to. I mean, you did, but they, they don't think you have to, but really, I'm mind controlling you, and you clearly had to donate because I made you donate, and all that shit, fuck up. Thank you ever so much, mate. Take care. Enjoy your farm work, whatever you're looking after. Cows, chickens, whatever you're looking after. Blah, 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 blah. Thank you ever so much. Damn bully must be an accountant. God damn it. Oh, dear. Thank you ever so much, dude. Thank you. And you, Shinobi. You know, your poor little blob just got bullied a bit, but still. T7's blob's got 999 health. That's quite interesting. Now I can buy lunch. Lovely. I always wanted to buy lunch. I always, I like, I was always wondering, like, how, I want to let lunch. Fuck off, bitch. It's jelly because I got lunch and she hasn't. What's this farm area called? Death, apparently. Are we still alive? No, we're not still alive. Uh, this is the uh, DLC. This is like the... This is just before the first boss in the DLC. Ugh. My weird sound effect. I don't have weird sound effects. It's all legit. How about a wooden shield only run? Can you actually do damage with a wooden shield in this game? Uh, by the way, I think we're good uh, to go and try and probably beat somebody up. Should I get Dark Souls 2? Yeah, 100% dude. Like I said, if if there's anybody here that's not played any of them, or maybe only played like Dark Souls 1 but hasn't played Dark Souls 2 or 3, or only played Dark Souls 3 and not played 1 or 2, like if there's two of those games that you haven't played, uh, ne no, not next month, the month after next month, in October, I think the 19th, uh, a trilogy version will be released where you get all three of the games. So it may be worth waiting until then. You get Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3. But I think you get Dark Souls Remastered 1, 2. No, Dark Souls Remastered, which is 1, 2, and 3. I'll get it right eventually. So it may be um, worth waiting if, you, if it's like at least two of the games uh, that you haven't played yet. Uh, Dark Souls 2 is a very complete game. Like, a very complete game. Probably the most complete uh, Dark Souls out of all of them. It's got a, a shit ton of um, exploring and stuff. <clears throat> 
And obviously the uh, trilogy comes with all the DLCs as well. It's a shame that the PS4 version of it doesn't include Bloodborne. I'm not sure what the tri what the price of the trilogy is. I'm guessing it's going to be like a full price game because it has got three games with all DLC. But I'd say it's worth it if you haven't played two of the games. If you played two of the games and you haven't played one, then I'd not I don't I wouldn't pay it. But if there's two of the three games you haven't played, I would probably um I'd probably get the trilogy. Fighting like we've got less speed in the first time. Also, I like the sound of the trailer. Does it come with all? Oh, yeah. I mean, Lud Ludwig's, Ludwig's a, a cool boss. Ludwig's a a tough one. Tough one. Ludwig's OST, like the uh, soundtrack, is fucking amazing. It's so intense. I think Ludwig's uh, soundtrack is like one of the few Bloodborne soundtracks that you can listen to when you're like not playing the game, and it still sounds pretty fucking cool. Quantity doesn't no like indeed, but like I'm saying like if you if you're it, obviously if you want to play the Dark Souls games and you haven't played them, then why wouldn't you get the trilogy? You know what I mean? It's like it's the way forward. It's, obviously, the trilogy is not worth it if you've already played all three of the games because that's like saying Final Fantasy 15 isn't worth it if you played Final Fantasy 15. It's like no fucking shit. It just pissed me off because there's somebody that reviewed the trilogy over here, and I think it was in Spain. And it's like, nah, it's not worth it, mate. It's like, well, how can you even fucking review a trilogy anyway? It doesn't even make sense. It's like you're reviewing the old games again. It's like a trilogy is just for people that haven't played it, or maybe a collector or something. But you can't say the games aren't worth it because it's like saying the, the original games aren't worth it because that's what it is. Still waiting for Demon Souls Remaster. I think everybody's still waiting for Demon Souls Remaster. I'm kind of hyped for the uh, Spyro trilogy actually. Kind of want to get that because I never really played much Spyro when I was uh, younger. So I'm kind of excited. Oh fucking Jesus Christ! D dodging on this game is actually really hard. Comp like if you if you spent the last five months playing Dark Souls Three, like dodging to the side is so fucking like you don't move, you don't go anywhere. <laughs> Compared to on Dark Souls 3 when you dodge this side. It's all about the one post. Yeah, I mean, like, yeah, maybe, like, if you if you had or, like, you just haven't even got, like, if, if you haven't actually got Dark Souls 2 anymore or, Dark, or one of the Dark Souls games and you want to play them again, then why not? Uh, Shenmue 1 and 2 is actually out already on uh, PS4. Uh, Shenmue, I'm not, I'm not sure if Shenmue 3 ever got a release date. I think it did. I'm guessing next year sometime. Can you separate a bit? Jesus Christ, you're being a rather, rather load of bitches. Staying this close to each other. So. Good hunter dodging. It's called bullshit. That's what it's called. Yeah. Poke him in the face. This is why I call the poke. This is why I call the great poke if he stops his fucking hunter's dodging. This guy knows how to hunt a dodge apparently. Jesus Christ. Poke in the face. Poke in the face. And we're up again. Like, what is it with this game and tombstones getting in the way? Like, I think 99% of the bosses on this game have tombstones to kill you. Jesus Christ. You see the new From Software game? Um, what, Sekido or um, Deracine? There's two new From Software games coming out. Uh, that's without counting, like, all the armored cores and stuff like that. I have seen Deracine and I have seen Sekido. Deracine is obviously the uh, VR game that FromSoft's, FromSoft's getting out for PS4, which kind of looks interesting as well. Like a VR game from, from software. Obviously nothing to do with like Dark Souls or anything, but looks okay. Looks interesting. Yeah, but Deracine is uh, a VR game, like PS VR game. So obviously if you don't own a PS VR, you may not be interested in that. And obviously it's nothing to do with Dark Souls. It's like some fairy tale or something like that. It looks interesting, just the fact, just because of the fact it's a from software game, and I do have PSVR, so I've kind of been waiting for a decent game to come out. Yo, Nizar, what's up? Yo, Arnold, big boy, what's up, big boy? Welcome to the stream, big boy. Never completed the DLCs for Dark Souls 2. Some of them are so good, like I, 
maybe not the first one. Like the first one's okay, but like DLC two and three are amazing. Like some of my favorite bosses are from DLC two and three. Um, on Dark Souls two, like our uh, DLC two has some um, Sir alone, which is an amazing boss, and DLC three has. I think DLC 3 uh, more more than the bosses. I enjoyed the area, so it was it was really cool. Uh, as as did we all, Tridian. As did we all. And apparently, it's more bosses than just one that wants you to get stuck on tombstones in this fucking. Area. Oh, okay, Arnold. Fine, be like that. No, it's alright. Just leave me. Just leave me here. It's okay. Take care. Speed Dark Souls one. Nice. DLC th 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 three, three. Shut up, Aries, mate. Welcome to my stream. It's okay. It's okay, Aries. Don't worry, but don't be jealous about it. Jesus Christ. Just because you don't have DLC th three, it's fine. Like jelly. Like if you only had one DLC back in your day, dude, it's okay. My God. You gotta be greedy. You don't have to be greedy in life, Aries. Just, just fucking be grateful for what you got. If you only got DLC one. That's all you need, really. It's all you need to be a happy boy. You don't need DLC 3 or 5 or 50, mate. Just, just be grateful for what you got. And if this bitch doesn't go... Oh, I think you got fed up and me follow and it's like, oh, I just punch you in the face with this thing. Really should have leveled up health. I, I, like, the torch is doing some good damage, but only because we've, like, used every fucking single one of our levels on Arcane to get damage with the torch. Yo, wheat then, what's up? Oh, if you haven't played Dark Souls 1, you should totally play Dark Souls 1, dude. See, now, like, that that's where the remaster is worth it. Like, if you've never played Dark Souls 1, 100% get the remaster. I'm sure, if you've already played Dark Souls 1, maybe it's not worth it, but... If you haven't played Dark Souls 1, the remaster is 100% worth it. Come on, we need... Oh, I need to get rid of this motherfucker before the other guys start poking me across the fucking map. <laughs> Yo, Snake. Uh, yeah, the torch is upgraded a bit. It's not too much. I can't remember what it is. Uh, maybe plus four or five. But at the moment, it is upgraded, yes. Obviously, this is the Hunter's Torch. But, like, the damage is mainly because we've used, like, every single one of our points on um, upgrading arcane so obviously the hunt is torch uh, um, s s scales if I can get the word right it scales with arcane so we're getting some okay damage just the, the only bad thing is that they will kill us really fast because we didn't uh, didn't level up health which sucks should have probably leveled up a bit of health oh fuck dead God, I hate it when they're just... Come on, dude. My torch should be faster than your fucking katana. I don't ask why, but it should be. I'm a specialist in torches and katanas. They used to call me the, the whatever, something like that. So I should know that a torch is faster than the katana. And if I say so... Oh my god, if you don't go fuck yourself. To be honest, the katana I was uh, talking about wasn't a stretchy katana, which sucks. These guys are rolling the stretchies. Not really a specialist on the stretchy katanas. Never seen one personally. To be perfectly honest. Quite rare in real life. So I'm not under no one doing. Come on, mate. Oh fucking hell. Oh poo poo. That's it, mate. All you have to do is just go for the torch. I'm using the torch, you use your torch, dude. It's no big deal. Just bait the torch attack. Go up to this motherfucker and punch him, or po poke him a few times with the torch. No biggie. And I'm getting hit by the other motherfucker. Yeah. Yo, Terry, what's up? Uh, I like to, I like to prove that I'm a big boy and suffer a little bit. Only a little bit though, because once we suffer a lot, then we'll just turn the game off. I'm an expert. They call me like, oh fuck me. Back at high school, they used to call me the expert, specifically because they knew. They knew that one point in the future I would be doing Bloodborne with a torch only. That's what. Oh, fucking hell. Like, all the time at high school, I was like, I wonder why they keep calling me the expert. I didn't realize that they knew that this was going to happen in the future, and that's why they were calling me the expert. Also, calling me a big boy. Like, some of the, some of like the people that preferred 
didn't like the word expert. Like, they just thought expert was too professional of a word. They just called me big boy. So, you know, it's obviously up to them. They could call me whatever I want, whatever they want, or whatever I wanted, because really it was me that wanted them to call me an expert or a big boy, not them. But that's a different story. So easy when there's only one left. Unless the snakes hit you, of course. Then shit goes downhill really fast, actually. It's not like one of those slowly declining downhill moments. It's one of those really, really steep downhill moments. I think we're about to see it here. No, we're not, because I'm really, really good at this game. Ouch. Just need to need to chill. Just a little bit. Chill. Oh, fucking Jesus, mate. Are you going to spam this all day long? Or what? Oh, fuck yourself, mate. Nobody even loves you anyway. See, that's what you get. Nobody loves... Oh, my fuck. Oh, no. Please. I'm sorry. I'm so fucking sorry. No, you're not. I'm not letting you get away with it, motherfucker. I'm not letting you fucking do that again, you little bitch. Come on. Keep on poking them. Don't... There we go. Fucking easy. GG. Let's go, boys. Let's fucking go. Because the challenge is fun. Why not? Why not? Ares, are you gonna... Are you gonna... Are you gonna... Are you gonna try and correct everybody that ever existed on this planet? Or what, mate? Everybody loves me, obviously. So you see that, guys? You see that? Exactly. Exactly. Thanks for the likes on the stream, guys. Because if you haven't liked the stream anymore, or yet, what's the point of living? Tell me. Like, just think about what is the point of living if you haven't liked the stream yet. I know you have, because you're not. You guys are pretty intelligent people. Like, I, I see you guys, and I'm like, these guys, these guys know what they're doing in life. These guys have their, have their priorities in life. They're straightforward kind of people. And I know that they've already liked the stream. I'm just, I'm just like... Just be like thinking out loud. I like one those people that don't like the stream kind of thing. Oh. Time for ROM hacks. God damn it. Okay, demon, take care of yourself, mate. Thanks for dropping by anyway. Thanks for dropping by. Good night to you too, mate. How you doing? What's the point of living? Uh, to watch my stream. I can't remember who it was, but somebody actually figured this out. Uh, the only point of living is to directly watch my stream. Um, no, Aries, please enlighten me with your um, with your mod-like abilities to enlighten one. That's very nice of her to level me up like that. Finally getting some HP. I know you had to cry. I know. I do appreciate it, like you tell me these things, though I already know them. But it's nice to hear them from you guys. I know Shinobi, like, it's the sacrifice. But I think the sacrifice is worth the wait, you know what I mean? Like, I've never experienced it, but, like, I would say that waiting for the stream is by far the worst part of it. But, like, it's worth the, uh, it's worth the wait. Uh, I think what we, hang on, wait, before doing ROM, what we're going to do is go and get the, um, the umbilical cord. I think. Where do I find your chapter in the Bible? You don't. You don't. Because, um... I got my own book. I, I didn't want to... I didn't want to boast about it. But I do have my own book. You know what? Actually, fuck. I'm not going to go and get the uh, umbilical cord. Fuck it. Not be Aries. What the fuck are you talking about? We know exactly what I know exactly what's going on here. Do you know exactly what's going on? Here? That's that's why, like Shinobi, you've got a point there. Every book is based around me. You think that every, and like a book is made from a human's imagination? No, it's not. They base everything. Everything you read is based around me. Um, Nosar, mate. If you woke up and looked yourself in the mirror and you looked like me, it's impossible to not be in love with yourself. Mate. Just say. Just say. Oh my god, it's so fucking hot in this room. Why do I live in this room? I literally live in this room because that's where my computer is and my computer is life. Or something like that, anyway. 
It must be over 40 degrees in this room, easy. I don't know, Yardy Cry. I don't know. Maybe we won't. You never know. I'm not saying anything. You could use a torch. They used. They. They. I'm not sure what we're gonna do against this boss. To be honest, I mean, Rom is is a weird boss. Like, if, oh, no, I don't make fucking you want welcome here. Apparently, Jesus Christ, get the fuck out of my way, bitch. Like, Rom, it depends because. If you're patient about it and you go around killing all the other little spiders, it's really not too bad. It's like people that are unpatient, like myself. By the way, didn't these spiders spawn very quickly? Or is it... Hmm. I thought he teleported away first time. Wait, what? Why didn't he... Te uh, maybe, I'm, maybe I'm forgetting something. I thought you always teleported away the first time without spiders appearing. Could be wrong. I guess I am wrong. I, I could have just sworn that the first time there wasn't spiders around. Unless it is the very first time there's spiders around and it's the second time there's not spiders until we teleport away. Okay, take care, dude. Thanks for running by anyway. Thanks for running by. Take care. I'm not really dead. Is it the second time the spiders don't appear then? So the spiders do always uh, spawn the first time. I thought you got him to disappear at least once without the spiders appearing. Um, what stats increase the torch? If it's um, if it's the hunter's torch like this one, it will scale with arcane. B actually, it's really really good. I think it's B anyway. Yeah, B B scale with arcane. If it's the normal torch, um, it won't. It will scale, but not that much. It will scale D with arcane. Uh, the difference is, is that the uh, the hunter's torch you can actually upgrade. The normal torch you can't. I do like Boris Johnson. That's a new one. <laughs> That's a new fucking one, isn't it? Jesus Christ. I think your brother got a patient. Is. Hey, well, I mean, like, I think that's the fun part about Dark Souls and Bloodborne. Wow, that's so weird. I, like, I, I must can just remember really badly. But I, I just thought that the first time you didn't have to put up with the spiders. Jesus fucking Christ, the spiders are so annoying. I, I thought the first time you just got a free hit on him, obviously not. Thinking about something else, I guess. I've only played this game 50 times, but I still can't remember something. Yeah, it's sat on boys. This torch is actually not a bad weapon, to be honest. Like, if you know how to upgrade and do shit, like, it's really not that bad. God damn it. <sighs> it's gonna take forever. Pretty much living wiki on this game. Clearly bragging. <laughs> God damn it. No, you're obviously right. Like I just this clearly things that I don't remember. That's insane actually. Never, never yard cry. We don't ask for help. We don't ask for help. I mean, it's not about like, asking for help. So when's the fist only run? Ah, uh, we did a fist only run on Dark Souls 3. I don't, not sure if I feel like doing it on Dark Souls, on Bloodborne. Uh, I think what we will do next run is uh, on Dark Souls 2 because it's been a long time since we played Dark Souls 2. Uh, maybe do a randomized to use what you see run like we did recently on Dark Souls 3 because that was a lot of fun. But on Dark Souls 2 because there's so much more weapons and stuff on Dark Souls 2. So basically, Ed, anything that we do on Dark Souls, or anything we pick up, randomized, we equipped it. Okay, Snake, thanks for dropping by, mate. Really do appreciate it. Really do appreciate it. God, I can't even talk today. Guys. Jesus Christ, that was close. Do a random texture. Like, I can't. I'm not actually sure if random texture is even a thing on any of the other games. To be honest, I only I could only find the random texture mod on Dark Souls Remastered. I haven't really looked that much, but I'm not actually sure if it is. There. I mean, the, the random texture mod is kind of interesting. It's just interesting to see, I guess. 
I think random uh, texture mode would even be more fun if you just use like completely custom textures, you know? Like textures that's not in the game. Alright, okay, let's go, boys. This torch is actually pretty fucking decent. At least against Rom. The good, the best thing that can happen against Rom is like when he's just about disappearing. If you stagger him, he will stay in the same place for a bit longer, and he won't summon the spiders, and you get a really, really good advantage on him. I, I, mate, I was literally fucking running. Like, I stopped running for half a second to get stamina back, and fuck my life. Fuck my life. It's been way too long since we played this shit. Oh, shut up, Aries, mate. I don't even trust in your bullshit anymore, Aries, mate. Oh, my God. We probably were the first person in the history to get hit by that shit, to be honest. Literally stopped running to get his stamina back, and it was dead. God damn it. You guys and Allier. Like, that is literally a fucking meme by now. I can't believe people are still talking about Allier. God damn it. I mean, I've never watched one of his videos, but my god. Uh, there we go again. To fight all the bloody spiders. That are totally not annoying. Maybe just a little bit annoying. Maybe very annoying, actually, to be honest. The thing is, like, the spiders, if you're not looking at every single spider, one can just land on your head and you're dead. Especially when you haven't really leveled up HP. Kind of sucks. Totally should have leveled up health. I kind of really wanted to get to um, 40 arcane. But I, I, like by the looks of things, we're having a hard time because of health mainly. surprising how much damage the torch does like even when you're not hitting like when you're hitting them in the head it still did an okay amount of damage you know that's the stagger he actually staggers way quick with the torch is rom actually um weak i think he's weak to fire um lightning not fire but still that's a lot of damage that's a lot of damage guys that's a lot of fucking damage T7, get back to your farm work, mate. Those chickens aren't going to leave themselves alone or something like that. What do you think, Pete? What do you think? My, my chat's not a normal chat. My chat is like the chat. No, 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 no. Oh, you're cooking the milk now? Or are you milking the cows? To oh, right, you're milk. Okay, I get it, I get it. You're in the farm milking the milking the cows to get the milk. Yeah, I, I get it, I get it, I get it. And now you're going to make some some cake with the milk or something like that. Something like that, right? Where am I, motherfuckers? Oh, that's so close. That attack's actually nerve-wracking sometimes. Especially when you're fighting the bloody spiders. Uh, well, I mean, um, Bloodborne only exists for PS4. Bloodborne is a PS4 exclusive, so we are playing on PS4. At least in my, my, um, planet. No, it's not a time, right? But I just, I meant that there's a little thing that... If you're on your first, uh, like when he first spawns in, if you stagger him just as it's disappearing, it'll stay there for like another five seconds and you can get some extra damage. Oh, fuck me. Oh, that was close. No, okay, okay. Okay, T7, we're still here. We're still milking the milk, mate. The mods are god, basically. By the way, did I mention I got a merch store? I don't think I did. Just saying. And the, t and the Discord server and all that good shit. I got a lot of things. Oh, fuck. That was good. Oh, 
Come on, boys, get it out of the fucking way. Okay, Shinobi, thanks ever so much, mate. Thanks ever so much for the donation as well. Really do appreciate it. Appreciate the support, dude. Take care and stay safe. Yo, Sakargento. What's up, dude? Hopefully I pronounced that right. How are you doing from Argentina? Idiot. Oh my god, I can't believe I got hit by that. Take care, Shinobi, take care. Yeah, come on, come on, come on, sh come on, T7, mate. You didn't even use the, the guide channel one. My god, what? T7 just gets carried away with the milk sometimes. So he just gets carried away with the milk. It's just, T7 is just so excited to get back to cooking the milk. It's just like, he forgot. But it's okay. No. These spiders seem so passive sometimes. Sometimes they're like, they're like just jumping all over the place just to kill you. And sometimes they're just so passive, it's like they don't even exist. Oh, fuck. Will we do it? I think we still need another go. Like, I know what's gonna happen. We're almost gonna kill him this time. It's gonna be like two or three hits away from dying. And I'm gonna be like, nah, I'm not gonna take the spiders out, guys. Like, he's only got a tiny bit of health, so there's no point of taking the spiders out. So we just go straight for Rom and then die. I think that's exactly what's gonna happen, let's be honest. Oh, that's probably gonna get me. Oh fuck. Cigarettes are healthy, 100%. Fuck off. If Tridian says it, it's obviously true. I've never said, never seen Tridian say something bullshit. Everything that Tridian has ever said in his life is 100% legit. Trust me. I've known him for ages. Dude, you need to stop fucking shaking about like that. Not cool. Can he actually disappear again? I, mean, I don't think maybe he can't actually disappear again. Maybe he only disappears like twice. I guess that's the point. Yeah, that was that. That was easy. What part of London from? Uh, I live in Spain, but my parents are from. I mean, I guess you'd say I'm from Essex area, but uh, I've lived in Spain most of my life, as I do now. But my parents were from Essex, if that makes any sense. Super Rom is a great one. Actually, Rom was like one of the original great ones, right? Like, Rom was one of the first great ones that they kept, like, in the universe or the fucking whatever the place this is. In Bergamsworth. Right, so now we have. Oh, I hate the great one. Like, you know when, when everybody, you know how everybody always has some um, accent had me fooled? Probably because, uh, probably because I'm, really, I'm, in, I'm from Spain. I mean, I, well, he did a pretty good guess. He did a pretty good guess, Aries, so I probably do have somewhat. But it's okay, Aries, just because you're, you're, you're just not good with accents. You only know about the Australian accent. All you care about is the Australian accent, but that's okay, mate. You know how everybody has that one boss that they have a personal kind of hatred to? And, um... The Great One's my personal hatred thingy, a Bob, you know what I mean? Rom was a student in Bergen who has tried to be... Oh, really? To be honest, I have not a clue. Like, I don't really know much about the uh, lore in Bloodborne. Never really have took much notice of it, to be honest. I'll take that as a compliment, Pete. I'll take that as a compliment somehow. How you doing today, Val? How you doing? You must be doing pretty good now you're watching my stream, I guess. But Right, um... Don't think we can upgrade yet until we get a few more chunks. I guess we'll just continue into... Yaharm Ghoul, right? So I guess we could have just went straight to the other one. Oh, you also have a blob in your stream? Nice. Nice. I actually watched a bit of your stream. I was it no, it was the night I don't think it was last night, it was the night before last night. You was playing the um the Horizon Zero Dawn DLC. I kinda stayed around for a bit. Let's keep it up. Let's keep it up. 
thing. Alright, let's go and get all these chunkios. We need the chunkios. We need to go and get the chunkios. Chunkios are important. Okay. I watched a bit of it, yeah. After my stream, I, I watched a bit until I went to bed, yeah. I had to do a few things around the computer, so uh, I had it on kind of in the background when I was doing anything. Sharp Tridium, mate. Jesus Christ. Should have known. Exactly, I have my own accent, and that's that's the beauty of me. I mean, like, why do you? Why would you expect a human to have a god, like, or a god to have like some kind of human-placed accent? It doesn't make any sense. You know? Yo, Mike, what's up, dude? I remember you. Welcome back. It's been a while. It's been a while, Mike. That was nice. That I think that was a pretty fair attack. Like, I think I designed that attack. That's a bit OP. Fuck my life. That was a fucking broken. Mad thing, blood. <laughs> I never said blood in my fucking life, except when we say bloodborne. <clears throat> I know, I know. Exactly, Val. Sometimes you just, you just don't expect it. You know, sometimes good things happen when you just don't expect it to happen. You fucking hate cost. Everybody hates cost. Some say cost them, though. I don't really. Un I don't know. Like out of all the people I know, I don't know a single person that says cost them instead of cost. So it's a weird world. Yo, Homer, what's up, boy? What happened in Florida today? Why is it always in Florida or California that some shit happens? What happened in Florida? What happened in California or Florida today? Probably nothing good. All right, ask school, mate. You just had to screw it up. Like, nobody, like I said, I didn't know anybody that says Cosm, and now you say Cosm. God damn it. <laughs> How you doing, TJ? Another fucking shoot and Jesus Christ, what is up with America these days? I mean seriously. In an esports tournament? God damn it, that is so fucking Oh god fucking world is stupid. It's it's a shit world, it's a shit world. It's a pretty fucked up world. Can I get away from this? Is that a tombstone? Please don't tell me that's a tombstone. Nah, it's just a piece of shit. It's just a piece of stupid statue in the way. It's always something in the way in this fucking game, I swear to god. God damn it. Were there many, like, did many people die in this uh, shooting? How many people were injured? I mean, god damn it, like, what's wrong with these people? Oh really? It was like, oh, damn, what the fuck is wrong with the world? This is like, it's just a shitty fucking world, seriously. <laughs> like, what the fuck is wrong with people? God damn, people honestly don't have anything to better to do in their fucking lives than just shoot somebody and go to jail and lose the rest of their lives. They clearly don't have much expectations for the rest of their lives if they don't care about being in jail, I guess. Fucking sad people. Yo, radio, what's up? Welcome. Yo, Steven, how you doing? Don't fucking bullshit me, mate. <laughs> I mean, like, the, the whole gun thing in America is just stupid, in my opinion. But that's just my opinion, I guess. If you don't want to make guns illegal because to defend your kind of house or something, then that's whatever but just make it illegal to carry a gun around the streets at least like fair enough if you want to defend your house then do what you want have a gun in your house but you, it should be illegal to take the gun outside the house though in my opinion but whatever. yeah people will find ways but it's like you've got to admit that compared to the rest of the world there's a pretty there's a quite a high number of shootings in the usa compared to the rest of the world where guns are illegal I'm not saying it's impossible because clearly there's shootings in other areas as well. But I think making guns guns legal may have something to do with the statistics. But, you know. I guess that's up to every fucking country. But sure, I mean there's terrorist attacks in all over the world. But, um... 
there's clearly more shootings in United States, especially these days, compared to the rest of the world. And I think that may have something to do with the legality of fucking life. But whatever. It's been a while already, it's been a while. I mean even like uh, in Spain, like re like a year ago is that our uh, Barcelona um terrorist attack. Like one thing's terrorist attacks that happen like maybe once or twice like every two or three years but then like it's just like the shootings are kind of getting out of hand in America just saying it may have something to do with the like guns are, are legal and open to every fucking body like you can you can have a gun license over here I mean you obviously can't carry it around the street but you can have a gun license and you can even, I think you can even have license to like keep them in your house. But you're not allowed to ha take them around the fucking street, are you? And even like that, you still need to go through like some psychological tests and shit. It's not just, oh, dude, I have that gun thing. And there's not really many shootings in countries that guns are legal, I illegal. Even though there are terrorist attacks, obviously. Huh. Anyway, it sucks, but whatever. Whatever. The life is like the world is still a pretty shit place. The world is still a pretty shit place. Let's let's agree with that one anyway. Can we? Um, kill Paul now. I think we should be able to kill Paul now anyway. Because, uh, last time we tried to kill Paul, it was like. Oh, fuck, let's not go that way. It was quite a while ago. Hello, Cypher. What is up, Cypher? Shut up, Cypher, mate. Shut the fuck up. Was it all the way. No, it wasn't all the way down the bottom. It was this one. Dude, go. Oh, gee, why? Do these guys always follow you this far? Holy crap. Hey, these guys are going a bit too far, if you ask me. Jesus Christ, no way that these guys follow you this far. Did these guys honestly follow you all the way this far? That is insane, dude. This guy is literally from the top. This guy is literally from where the other bonfire is. What the hell? By the Darksiders franchise? I have Darksiders on PS4. Um, not, I think I have, Dark no, I think I have both of them on PS4, actually. I think I have both of them on PS4. Are they free on Steam or something? Though you said buy. I got the remastered for PS4. But still, like, that's a good price though. Still a good price. Love this boss when you can't get behind him. I got both of them on... I think I got... Yeah, I'm 99% sure it wasn't one of them. I think it was... I never understand this boss. It's just... It's so random. It's like... it's. It's just a big blur of the fucking attack, and there's nothing you can do about it. And this this torch is so short. Oh my god, I hate this boss. It's such an easy boss as well. It's really weird. I mean, five dollars for both of them is absolutely amazing. I think I got both of them though. I think so. I can't remember for sure, but I'm ninety nine percent sure I had both of them. Let me just check. Fucking loading screen, it's gonna jam the PS4 right up. Thank you. Um, purchased. Dark Siders. Unless it was on the other account, it may have been on the other account. If it was the on the other account, it's not gonna be here. Oh no, there it is. Dark Siders 2. Defendant, D Death Image Edition. And Dark, yeah, we got both, both of the uh, new ones. Yeah, we, I got both the new ones on PS4 actually. Still a good price though, five dollars for both of them is absolutely incredible. That's what the loading. I mean, the, uh, the loading time on certain games is horrible. Agreed. Like it's very, on on Bloodborne, it's amazing. Uh, on, on Bloodborne, it's fucking ridiculously bad. I admit it. On other games, it's not too bad, but 
on Bloodborne is like the like the loading times on Bloodborne aren't um aren't too bad now, but before they was way way worse. Yo, Mohamed, what's up, mate? Welcome to the stream. How you doing? How you doing? I should have probably went back and upgraded the torch again before fighting this boss. I mean, this boss is kind of an easy boss, but I don't really know. Like, normally this is the type of boss that you just walk in and slap him a few times and it's dead. And you never realize his, uh, we um, his, uh, like, attacks. Dark Souls is good. Oh, right, you mean when you press the home button. I mean, normally it's not too bad, it's, but we was in a loading screen on Bloodborne, which obviously, uh, takes most of the process and power up, and that's why it's so slow. Depends what you're doing on the game also. Oh fuck. I really never did understand how the fuck you get away from that attack sometimes. Like if you're underneath it, which chances are you are? Come on bitch. And my weapon is so short, like when you're underneath him, you can't, I can't hit him with this weapon, it's so fucking short. It's like if I stand in front of him and get slapped, I can't actually hit him. Oh fuck, I'm dead. I hate this boss so much. Like if you are a great sword, this boss is so easy, but like when you're underneath him with a torch, it's just... I don't understand. Fuck oh, off. I think we need may need a bit more damage. I keep I'm literally spamming the button and I can't hit him. So annoying. You gotta be on the outside to hit him with this, and like if you're on the outside, you're gonna get slapped. Oh. Normally, if you get underneath him with a great sword and just fucking spin around, you'll kill him. With the torch, you can't do that. Dark Souls one and two is both good. To me, it's like personally, I do, I did personally like Dark Souls. Dark Side is one better, but Dark Souls two is really good as well. I don't know why, to be honest. But obviously, I, I like you know, it's okay. Yeah, uh, let's go back and upgrade the weapon. Actually, fuck that. I don't have the original versions anymore because I don't have a PS3, so. Oh dear. This is horrible. Okay, dudes. Okay, mates. Let's go and uh, upgrade on him. That is a big kin thing. What is your best game of all time? Like, my favorite game of all time? Uh, obviously, apart from Dark Side. Dark Side, he's got that. Da um, Dark Souls. Uh, I don't know. Like, I. I like a lot of different games, I guess. I like a lot. I mean, my when I was younger, uh, the Ocarina of Time was probably my favorite game. I know a lot of people probably say that, and it's just not like a fun thing to hear anymore, but it's just it's just true. Uh, I really like Dark Souls, but I love other types of games as well. Like, I'll give any type of game a chance. I thought God of War was really, really good. Uh, also, Detroit Become Human was a good game. Like, I'm talking about recent games right now. Persona 5 was amazing. Even Final Fantasy 15, I absolutely love that. I have so many. I'm not even sure if I can say one favorite game, to be honest. Not Ace Attorney. Ace Attorney is fucking shit. Who the fuck plays that game? Most people probably don't even know what that is. It's so shit. I think my most underrated favorite game is um, a game called Resonance of Fate. That's my most underrated game. Which is amazing. No, I haven't finished Persona 5, to be honest. I just haven't had the time. I need to finish that. The world ends with you. I'm I'm probably getting that for the Switch. It comes out soon for the Switch. I never played the end world the world ends with you, so I'll probably get that for the Switch. I played Tales of Fantasia on Fantasia on I can't remember if it was the Game Boy or something like that. Ages ago. I mean, like, Persona 5 is, like, probably my favorite game of last year, but I haven't finished it. I just haven't had the time. But it was, it was so good. It was, like, as if you was watching an anime or playing an anime, and uh, it, was, it was just a cool experience, I guess. It was a cool experience, but I need to finish it. I haven't finished it yet. 
I haven't actually got that far at all. Yeah. So many games. So many games. Because like the thing is, when I really like a game, I try and play it all the way through. And all like even platinum it sometimes if I got the time. But like Persona Five is just such a heavy like long game. Like the last two games that I played like a lot, like specifically two on the Guides and Walkthroughs channel, uh, Adventure Time game, which wasn't amazing, but it was still entertaining. I already plat I platinum that game. And I would actually have the Platinum to uh, Death's uh, Gambit if they wasn't bugged out. But uh, two or three of the trophies on Death Gambit are actually bugged, so I'm sorry. This is such a bad boss to fight with a torch, by the way, holy shit. This guy's so aggressive as well. Like, if you, if, if you don't get underneath him, this boss is actually pretty fucking tough. The thing is, like, even, I can't really get underneath him with this weapon. Because um, I can't hit him unless I specifically aim for a foot. Mate, if you don't go fuck yourself and you're stupid fucking aggressiveness, you need some therapy to calm the fuck down, you dumb little bitch. Jesus Christ. Get. Oh my god. The thing is, like, other weapons stagger this guy so easily, and this, this weapon just doesn't stagger, and it's so annoying. I think the only boss that this weapon staggers is a meteor. And this boss is actually going to be quite... I'm, I'm just wasting... Um... Blood vials, I think. Hey, we fucking reached his toe. Oh, love. He hasn't staggered us. Like, this boss is so easy to stagger. He just doesn't stagger with the torch. Probably because we can't hit him with the fucking torch for a start. Oh my god. Jesus, this buzz is horrible with the torch. There we hit him. Oh fuck. Come on out. I think we still only hit him once first. So. There we go. Jesus Christ, when will he stagger though? I suppose it's actually frustrating me right now. I can't hit the bastard. Jesus Christ. Oh, I'm dead. I can't hit the bastard. It's pissing me off in ways that you guys couldn't even think possible to get pissed off on pole. How did that fucking... Oh, hit the... No, oh, we're dead. <laughs> oh my god, this boss is going to be hard as hell with the torch. Like, you can't hit him. Oh, fuck, fuck. Now we need to go and farm some esters as well. My head actually started hurting from reading the text boxes. Really? What the fuck? I don't know. Sometimes, like, on that thing, like, the, um, the refresh rate, and, well, not just the refresh rate, like, the hurts and, hurts and stuff, the, like, the TV refresh rate actually, um, actually makes quite a lot of difference, to be honest. Like, on, on this monitor over here, the ultra-wide one, which has got, like, uh, I think it's only, like, even 120-something, refresh rate or even 200 but like this one's just a standard 60 and you can actually tell the difference sometimes my head hurts on this mono but in that one it just never does it's actually quite weird let's go back to get some blood bells. Hmm. my tin puff god that, that guy is actually fit like normally with a great sword you would just walk into pal smack him a few times underneath with a great sword, and he would stagger pretty much until the end of the battle. But with the torch, because it's like poke, and you gotta be exactly where his foot is, and it's so short as well. I just have an issue with the text box has been on the left hand side instead of being in the center. Oh, really? Alright, Val, you may be being a bit pickish right now, I'm just saying it. You may be being a bit of a picky person. Didn't want to say it, Val, but you're a picky person. Why does it matter if they're on the fucking left-hand side of the screen? Are you against people on the left-hand side of the screen? There's nothing wrong with people on the left-hand side of the screen, okay? You could offend quite a lot of people here, Val, by saying left-hand side screen. Ain't cool. Bang. My torch is currently on the left-hand side of the screen, and I may be offended about that. 
You need to be careful how you offend people. I made my it made my heart. What that you oh right, the the thing that, okay, that's just weird. So just because it was on the left hand side that oh, that's interesting, I guess. See Aries is left handed and now he's offended, got that. Shut up, Caffrey, mate. I mean, how you doing, Caffrey, mate? Absolutely amazing to see you. How are you doing today? Absolutely doing amazing, I see. Good to hear. Good to hear, Caffrey. Good to hear. Uh, what do you mean, what's going on? We're just, we're just poking this bastard in the face a few times. Nothing new. Just poking. Just poking around. Uh, today we've killed Rom. With kill we have killed... Um, Shadows. Uh, we're doing all right, actually. Yo, Lethal. What's up, dude? Welcome back. Probably not getting enough sleep. That happens to me a lot. As soon as I don't get enough sleep, my head starts hurting. And like, I don't sleep a lot these days, and my head hurts quite a lot. The thing is, like, I'm allergic to paracetamol and stuff like that, so I can't even have that for headaches. The only thing I can take for headaches is um, ibuprofen. It would be amazing if Val did a review on that game. Uh, one out of ten, the text box is one on the left hand side and it made my head hurt. GG. Chill the fuck up. That, that would be Val's review. That would be good. That would be amazing. <laughs> you finished the first palace. You, you just try and keep playing it though. Maybe just send it into the send it into the developers. Uh, please make a patch where I can change the text to the right hand side of the screen. Not the... You need to do that review. You need to just upload a review. Don't like. Don't care what else is on your channel. Just upload a review of Persona Five and say, one out of ten. Text box is on the left hand side. Made my head hurt. What the fuck are you doing? Yeah, you have to. Um, you have to pretty much. You don't get Estes on. On Bloodborne, it's like if you ever play Demon Souls, it's like on Demon Souls, except there's a limit of 20 per life. Uh, but yes, you do like Blood Vows are an another item you have to farm or pick up. Yes, luckily there is this area in the DLC that's where we're at now, where you, it's like right next to the to the lantern, and um, you can get five every time guaranteed. It's kind of a mixture in between Demon Souls and Dark Souls. Like there's a limit like on Dark Souls every time you die, the limit is 20, but um. <clears throat> but it's like on Demon Souls where you have to pick them up. Though on Demon Souls, I was like, there wasn't really a limit. I mean, there was, but much higher. You can you can purchase them, but like every time you purchase one, it gets more and more expensive. So at the end, it's probably not even worth it. Yo, chop chop, what's up, boy? Cause it was, cause it's not bizarre, mate. I'm a big boy. I'm God. I can do whatever run you guys want me to do, except the pebble run. Just shout about the pebble run. Yeah, people say that um, Persona 5 is minimum 100 hours. But if you do everything like Platinum, it's quite a lot more. Quite a lot more. Right, I think that'll do for now anyway. Shut the fuck up, mate. Fucking bullying me. Fucking talking about my fucking pug like that. Don't like it. Yeah, the Hunter's Torch is actually quite good. Like, this, this is not a bad weapon. I mean, it's not the best weapon. Mainly because of the moveset. You've only got one moveset, which is Poke. You've got one attack, which is poke. And against bosses like Pole, for instance, it's pretty shit. And we're probably not going to try Pole for now. But um, apart from that, it's not too bad. Um, let's go and uh, let's go and continue to the Great One. I hate the Great One, by the way. Can't stand the Great One. Well, no, it's not the Great One. It's the, what's he's called? The One Reborn. Absolutely fucking hate that boss. Like, it's that one boss that everybody says is easy, but I just have a personal problem against this boss. Hmm. Oh, my God. That's the thing about, um, like, if, if the game's really good, I will try and go for the Platinum, and that's, like, Persona 5 is one of those games. How many hours sleep do I get? Not much, not much. Probably about four, five, six hours sleep. Something like that. I, I just can't sleep more. I just... Like, I'm tired as fuck, but uh, I just feel like if I sleep anymore, I'm just wasting my life. Basically. 
Hmm. Persona is a video game. Is, is video? Yes, yes, it is, is video game. Carefree. Persona is a video game. That is, that's correct. What well am I? Proud of you. Proud of you, Carefree. Uh, let's go this and get this chunk, which will allow me to level up the weapon one more time. Oh no, this is bolt paper. Probably, there's another chunk around here, I'm 100% sure. Where was- oh, there it is. Well, there's two of them. There's that. I think there's another one near, near over there somewhere. Oh my god, there's, everything is in the way in this game. Those things are lovely. <laughs> Yo, Piper, what's up? How you doing, Piper? Good to see you. How are you doing? How's your octopies doing today? I can deconstruct anything. I can literally deconstruct yourself into atoms, mate. Do you want me to do that? I didn't think so. Exactly. So let's let's behave ourselves carefully, mate. Let's just behave. Like I I could deconstruct Piper's uh, octopus into some lovely sushi, if you want. Sorry, uh, sorry, Piper. That was probably a bit, probably a bit too violent. I gotta admit. Don't feel sick. Don't 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 do that. You don't want to feel sick. Like feeling sick is not a good thing. Yeah, it's not it's not a good thing. I don't. Yeah, I mean, I kind of like. In all fairness, I do want to play Octopath Traveler, but I don't know. It looks like a good game. But I still haven't played. I would like. I will play it eventually. Octopath Traveler. I just haven't got around to it. Octopus reminds me of Octopath. Huh. I wonder why. Really don't know why, Cipher. Really don't know why. Give me my chunkyos, bitch. I need my chunkyos for breakfast. Oh, I'm sorry, Carefree. I'm sorry, mate. I'm just, I'm just saying that feeling sick isn't a good thing. Just in case zombie thought it was. I just needed to clear things up for zombie. Jesus Christ! Shut the fuck up, Carefree, mate. I can say whatever I fucking want. Next time I'll be saying Carefree actually cares about stuff. Yeah, the people that die have never died before, by the way. Just in case you didn't know that. The fuck are we talking about, anyway? Here we go, boys. Wait, I think there's at least one more chunk around here. I'm not even sure if we need all that. Ah, fuck the chunks. I'm not even sure if we need them. If we die, we probably will go back and um, level up. I um, probably level up the weapon, guys. Because we're probably going to die. I hate this fucking boss. Ah, shut up, guys. Shut the fuck up. You guys don't even know what you're talking about. You guys are like dum dums. You guys are like dum dums compared to me. Like my IQ would just boggle your heads in ways you can't imagine. So let's just be quiet. You have none of that, motherfuckers. Guy, oh my fucking Christ! This is the part I hate about this boss. Sometimes you come up here, just smack these people a few times, and nothing bad happens. Other times you come up here and you just get sat on by the bitch down the bottom. It's kind of annoying. Uh, no, Piper didn't lose her mod status. She just made another account because she wanted to feel like a normal person on one of her accounts. Basically. Unlike you, Carefree. Unlike you. Poke him in the face. Poke him, poke him. What was that item that was really good on this boss? I don't think we've got any more. Was it the shame? No, no. It's okay, Homer. Don't worry about it, dude. I got it all under control. Tap that. I hate that. Never have that under control. Jesus Christ, some people go mental when you're using a torch. I swear to God, everybody's so much more aggressive when you're using a fucking torch. It's like they're jelly or something. I know this guy is weak to weak to fire, though. What the fuck, dude? Can I attack one day? That'd be lovely. Oh, 
we go, boys? No, we're not because we're fucking dead. Never mind. I don't even know what killed me. I, I think his literally his little toe fell on top of my head. Seriously. Sad little fucking people. Sad people. Fucking lost that game so he fucking shot people. Like, well done, mate. I don't know why they don't even have gun controls in these kind of, like, events or... Like, with the amount of terrorists and shit around these days, like, why don't you just have an... Like, if there's an event with a lot of people around, just do a gun control or something at the entrance, at least. Yo, trap fan. Thanks for the sub, mate. Welcome to the stream. Uh, we should probably actually went to the uh, other bonfire or the other lanterns for this. I don't even know if they need to sneak guns in. Like, if it's America, it's legal, right? Sad enough, but it is. I'm not sure if it's legal to take it to events like that, but, like, because having guns in America is legal anyway. I'm not even sure if that counts as, uh, well. I don't have a fucking clue how that works, I guess. Like, guys, I lost at Madden, so I'm gonna fucking shoot somebody. Fucking piece of shit. Like, who plays that game anyway? That game's like so fucking five years ago. Yo, Nexus, what's up, mate? Welcome back to the stream. How you doing? Hey, then, Nexus. I would appreciate it if this guy wasn't killing me when I was fucking taking out the witches because that would be absolutely splendid. Every fucking time. Fuck you and your life. Jesus Christ. Where are we going? What was I going? I was going to do something. What was I going to do? Oh yeah, I was going to go to the other um, entrance. Actually, let's go there. I I don't know. Like this is like political talk, and I really don't like talking about this. But I just think it's so fucking dumb that you can carry around something that can literally just kill somebody in a blink of an eye. Especially knowing how fucking doo doo human race is. To be honest, like the human race is so fucking dumb. Like, how can you let that happen? But, uh, whatever. Humans will be humans, I guess. Stupid little planet, I guess. But, um, whatever. 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 What? What's not confirmed yet? Like, that he was somebody that lost in the tournament? Like, even if he was or wasn't somebody that lost in time, it's so fucking stupid. Yo, El Noob, what's up, dude? Welcome to the stream. Okay, James, take care, mate. Thanks so much for watching. Take care, dude. Take care. Thanks for dropping by. It's 4 a.m. there. God damn it. Like, what, what time is it here? I'm not even sure what time it is. It's about 10 a.m. I'm um, 10 p.m. here. 10 o'clock at night here. So I guess you can't even call that evening anyway. I mean, it's still nighttime where I live. Hmm. 
It, I would appreciate it if I could go up to one of these motherfuckers up here and not die by this guy down here. Like, it's, it's annoying because it's not really much you can do about it. It's like sometimes you just walk up, kill all four of them, no problem. Sometimes you just... Okay, Nexus, take care, dude. Thanks for coming by. Thanks for coming by. Why am I getting so unlucky? Like, every, like, three out of three attempts now. Oh, alright mate, you're not fucking helping you little bitch. Three out of three attempts we've been hit by the idiot down bottom. Yay, carefree. Congratulations, mate. We carefree. Citizenship. Woo. Nuggets don't have British accents, Homer. Sorry about that, dude. Nuggets will be nuggets their whole life, I guess. Nuggets don't really have accents in general. Is my game jamming up again, like yesterday? I know how to fix it, I just didn't think it would uh, reset itself though. This boss is so random, like its toe can just explode. It's like, oh, you're, you're hitting? Uh, let me let 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 this let let me uh, get that toe to explode to do a bit of damage and piss him off. I mean, like we should be able to do this to this one. I don't think the tail counts as a. Something we can. What? Like, oh fuck, okay. I know what's hitting me. Right. Oh fuck. Dude, can you stop with the poison fucking poo? Jesus Christ. I'm not even sure what part we hit before. I think we hit the back of it, so that's. I think this is the back of this thing. This ugly motherfucker. I, I'm guessing that's the back of it. Can't guarantee that this is the back of it, though. I think it's the back of it. I think it's staggered, so now we'll move on to the next foot and try and stagger this one. Like this, this boss is actually our weak to fire, even though it doesn't really look like it. Like this is one attack that this guy can do that he just goes complete ape shit. Probably that. <laughs> so dumb. Fucking insta kill me then. <laughs> My god. Yo, Elliot, not too great. Uh, let me just see if I can. Because I've noticed that the game jamming up on stream a tiny bit. Let me see if I can uh, just change something here. I think it should be okay. Maybe it was only a one time thing. <laughs> no. Can you please beat this boss? Oh uh, yeah, sure mate, sure. Let me just uh, sort shit out. Like I said, this is the like the, the typical personal boss I hate. Even if it's not too bad, but like, you know there's always that one boss that everybody hates, personally. On like a personal kind of level. This is my boss. This is the boss I hate on a personal level. We already beat Freed, what the fuck are you talking about, Carefree? We beat Freed. We actually completed that run, believe it or not. That's why we're playing this. We did, we actually already we killed Gale as well. That was lucky. <laughs> Fucking lucky. Damn it, Carefree, mate. We're miles beyond Freed. We're literally on the next run from Freed. We should we could actually go back and level up the weapon if I'm not mistaken, right? I think so. We got nine uh, blood chunks. I got two citizenships, citizenships. What, for Spain? You don't need a citizenship for Spain, I don't think. Like, um, I, c I can freely, I can move around freely anywhere in the uh, in the European Union. Even though England's or UK is not going to be in the European Union for long, but right now I can move around freely anywhere.
I'm probably not to live there, I guess, but I don't think it's that hard. But is that isn't that hard to um like get a citizenship to live anywhere in the U um, European Union? I don't find it that I don't think it'd be too hard, right? Because my parents did live in England for a long time, and then they moved over and um then they lived in Spain, and now they're living in Spain. I don't think it's too hard to get a citizenship. Here. Not for countries like Spain, anyway. Or, anyway. Well, I mean, there's probably some countries in the European Union that's probably more uptight about it, but I don't know. You can leave England, just go for it. Come over and live in Spain, mate. Like, why not, dude? I don't think it's that hard to get a Spanish citizenship. So we, we, I, you know, we, it's all right, Aries, mate. We can go, go out for a tea party, make some cups of teas. We can may if you want, if, if you feel like it, Aries. We could go and open up a cup of tea shop. We'll call it a cup of tea. Spelt like O T, you know what I mean? Cup O T. Fucking so many ideas. Just if only I had a British person as a friend. You wanna be my friend, Aries? You can be my friend. Yo, Sebastian. Our uh, secular looks okay. Definitely doesn't look really much like Dark Souls, but it looks okay. Oh my god, this boss is so random and annoying in so many different fucking ways. What is he doing? This boss is just really random, I think. Dropping shit from the sky, quite literally. Like, when do I attack, mate? Do I have a chance? May I please attack? I know it, Matthew. That's that's just the way I roll, you know. That's the way I like to roll with the challenge runs. Doesn't feel much like a challenge run right now. Probably will do on the DLCs though. Uh, I'm actually really hyped for Devil May Cry 5. Can't wait for Devil May Cry 5 to be honest. Dude, just chill the fuck out. Oh fuck my life. Oh my god, that's so good. Is he gone? He's staggered the fuck down. That fucking lot. I'm not sure, like, you could obviously, if you hit him in the head now, he does a lot of damage, but I'm going for the other strategy. Just going around all four limbs and staggering. Probably not the best of ideas, to be honest, but fuck it. Probably would have been a better idea with this weapon. I, I was kind of expecting him to stagger straight away, but apparently not. With other weapons, you can make all four limbs just keep staggering, kind of thing. And normally, with other weapons, he would have been dead by the end of the four limbs, but with this weapon, he probably isn't. But it looks like things is going to have about half health left after all four staggers. Maybe just a bit less than half health. Yo, 12, what's up, boy? What's up, boy12? Welcome back to my amazing stream. I think, I don't even think, wait, that's not even the limb we've got left, right? <laughs> I think I'm hitting the wrong one. I think it's this one. Is it? I don't even know anymore. Like, he turned around in a weird fashion. I'm not sure which one's the limb we've got. I think it's this one. Well, apparently not, because... He doesn't really seem to be carrying much with his limb. He's still doing damage, I guess. Clearly the wrong limb, I guess. Oh fuck, I could be dead here. Is that is that what your dream oh my fucking god. Is that what your dream is, mate? It's watching me play Metal Gear Solid. I know it's the dream of a lot of people. Jesus Christ, dude, chill the fuck out. 
guy has no chill at all. There it goes. I was going to say, like, fucking hell, I'm pretty sure it's that limb. Unless you can stagger the limbs twice. Look at that damage. Maybe that was... Yeah, I'm pretty sure that was probably going to be a bit... Like, normally it's not, but, like, with this specific weapon, I guess this is probably the better strategy. Don't fuck it up now, all right, mate? Just don't fuck it up now. It's so easy to fuck it up now, but we don't want to fuck it up now. Do we? We're not about that life. We're not about the fucking it up now life. It's dead. See? Easy GG. Oh, is the Emu Paradise and dead? That sucks. It's been a long time since I've actually emulated a game, but I didn't know that. I have to teach you Spanish. Alright, mate. Like, if I teach you Spanish, we'll open up a Capo Tea shop. And we'll... We'll be rich motherfuckers. If we make a cup of tea shop over here in Spain, just go to a go to an area touristic kind of area um, with um, with a load of British people. You're pretty much sorted, really. Pretty much sorted. Let's go and upgrade our weapons. Does the average Spanish person know English? No, <laughs> nope. Like, I know, I know, like, you think, like, oh, I just go to this country and, like, as long as you know English, you get by. No, Spain is not one of those countries. 100% big no-no. Like, I know there's a lot of countries that you could probably get by with English, but Spain is not one of those countries. Spain is totally not one of those countries. You can't, Tridian, no. They're not on the menu yet. Maybe one day, though. Welcome. Maybe one day. Oh, we need to go and farm some more Welcome. blood vials, by the way. Um, let's go and get... Fuck it, I'll blow up this. Fuck health. Nobody needs HP anyway. Right? Nobody needs HP anyway. Now we may as well just spend the rest of them. They're gonna get lost. Fuck it. And that's why they teach us English. Right? No, but like, in all fairness, like, they do teach Spanish... Like schools, like school in, in Spain, you do have to learn English and most universities as well. But the average person doesn't know English is actually really fucking weird. It's just really weird. But no, they, they don't know English. You cannot come over here, in, here to Spain and defend yourself with English. When are you going to dye your hair? I'm going to get a haircut probably tomorrow, actually. I keep saying this, but still. Probably tomorrow I'll get a haircut. Yo, Max, what's up, dude? What's up? Right, uh, let's get the hell out of this place. We leveled up our weapon. We we can we need to level up one more time. I'm getting a haircut tomorrow. Nice, dude. Haircuts are for cool kids sometimes. Yeah, that's what I meant. Like, like I want to go to Japan, and apparently you can defend yourself quite well with English in Japan. Not amazingly, but. Normally you can in a lot of, like, there's a lot of countries. Like, I had this friend at one point here that was Romanian, from Romania. And he learned, he, like, he literally spent, like, a lot of time spending English before coming over to Spain. And he's like, right, I learned English, and now I'm going to fucking go over and see the whole world. Because now I know English. And he literally, the first country he visited was Spain. And it was like, yo, guys, what's that? It's like, nobody understood him. It's like, I felt so bad for him. It's like, yo, what's up, boys? It's just like, what the fuck is this guy saying? I guess that's like. I think we already skipped a chunk. Lantern here. God, the first time I remember the first time I came here, I completely missed this lantern. Yo, boy, chill the fuck. Up. You can learn Mandarin or Japanese. I'd love to learn Japanese. Like, I would learn Japanese if, if like, I decide to go and live in Japan, then 100%. But if it's only going just to visit, then I'm not learning Japanese. Okay, Val, take care. Good luck on your stream. Probably not as good as mine, but almost, and that's pretty cool. Just being almost as good as mine. Good luck. Mikolash is next, yes. Apart from three words in Greek. That's something, right? That's something. That's like... 
Probably more than the three words that most people know in Greek. I stream on Twitch, nice. That's where Val streams. I actually did watch a bit of it the other day. You got an F in school in Spanish, nice dude. I think Spanish is probably a lot easier to learn than English, like if you're foreign. Like, I think it's a lot easier to learn Spanish if you're English than English if you're Spanish, though. Yeah, so just, like, just because like his dad's from Greece, now he thinks he's the god of war or some shit like that. Just let him live with his little fantasy, though. Oh, fuck. Yes, you, 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 you are welcome to go and join Val's stream after my stream is finished. <clears throat> just saying. Sometimes in my brain doesn't want to understand the logic in Spanish. I mean, I'm like, it's probably because I know Spanish and English since like young and I didn't really have to go through the process of learning it. But I just feel like Spanish is a lot easier than English. Like from a learning point of view. Like I'm not, I'm not sure. Maybe, maybe I'm mistaken. It just feels like the words kind of just make sense more than English or just the way they're written, I guess. Spain just seal, seems like a lot more simplistic. It's okay, guys. You can watch Val's stream at the same time as watching my stream. It's all going to be okay. For now. <sighs> oh, fuck off, you stupid little bitch. This language is in English. I think Spanish is English, e easier than English. Like in Spain, there's no weird fucking. Like the weirdest the writing can get in Spain is literally a CH. That's like literally the weirdest it gets. And there's a letter that doesn't exist anywhere else, which is N Y, which is like a, an N with a little squirrel above it, like a little line above it. But that's like not really that used. I don't know. I could be mistaken, but it just feels that way to me. Oh, okay, 12. Okay, I see the way we're going about this, 12. I see the way we're going about this. That's okay. That's okay. It's okay, dude. Don't worry about it, 12, dude. I'm not going to have any hate for you or anything like that. I'm not going to deduct all your pug snacks and ban you from the channel for life or anything like that. That's just your imagination. Don't worry about it, dude. That is not going to happen, 100%. What am I even getting hit by for fuck? I'm literally... Oh, fuck me. Fuck you. Stupid fuck bitch. I'm not talking about 12, by the way. I mean, it's not really... Like, in all fairness, Carefree, that's not fair. Because you're literally comparing a god to a human. And I think Varus stream for a human stream is actually pretty lit. Just saying. And we got chunky old. That's pretty cool. Let's watch your eye, I didn't know. Yo, Fearless, what's up, mate? No problem, dude. Back in the day, I probably didn't have a face. <laughs> Back in the... God, I'd probably watch my Dark Souls 2 videos right now. It must be so cringy. But I'm glad they helped people, honestly. How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Your version of Sekido at GameStop. Okay, alright. Limited edition of Sekido. Nice. I need to do that myself. Probably not limited edition, I'm not sure. I'm a relatable person. It's, that's quite ironic coming from a human to a god, though, isn't it? I have my live voice and my 100%. Uh, remember, like, if, if you guys still are interested in walkthroughs, we did open up a new channel dedicated just to walkthroughs. Like, this channel is just dedicated to live streams now, and we did open up a new channel just for live like, walkers. I mean, yes, Carefree, I'm such a re relatable person, and you guys and humans get along with me really nicely and all that great shit. 
Well done, Carefree, mate. I'm proud of you. Uh, this is the Hunter's Torch, obviously. The regular torch you can't even upgrade. The Hunter's one you can, and scales pretty nicely, as you can see with Arcane. Still annoying that you only get one poke attack and everybody can just dodge it. See, we're even having a hard time killing these motherfuckers. Not because of the damage, just because of the, the moveset. Like, it's so slow, and you only get one pokey poke. That is kind of not cool. It's the only downside to this run, I think, because every... Jesus Christ, like, the poke is so annoying that you miss so many attacks, isn't it? Even when you're locked down, you'll be surprised. That was a bit dumb. The damage isn't amazing. Like, the further you go through the game, the the more you can tell that the damage isn't great. But there are parts in the game, like, one, if, you're, if you've got it upgraded enough and leveled up enough arcane for, like, Amelia, like, the damage is fucking insane. Thank you, 12. You heard you can't upgrade your weapons and you can't get new weapons in Circuit. I have no idea, mate. I have absolutely no idea. I haven't really investigated anything into Sekiro yet. Like, I don't have time. Like, more, probably more closer to the date of release, I'll probably look into it a bit more. Red passports, Lou. Well, I mean, like, obviously I have a British passport, so, yeah. My red passport looks okay. I gotta agree with that. Because <coughs> like even if, even if I live in Spain, I still technically got all my passport and stuff or whatever in English. Like the only Spanish thing I've got is uh, is my driving license, and that's it. That elevator could be called Disney. Right? I'm actually thinking of going to uh, Disneyland. Next year, maybe. I'm not sure. The beard always comes back, mate. The beard will never leave for good. You don't understand this, do you, 12? You just don't understand, do you? Wow, that damage is fucking shit. What the fuck? Tell me somebody just seen that his ninja... What? Why has everybody got ninja moves, may I ask? Tell me that I'm not the only one but just seen him just do a ninja fucking move and jump completely over the top of me like that. I want to see that again, mate. I'd love to see that again. What do we... Oh, my God. Loading screens. I need to see that again. I'm pretty sure we just seen what I seen, right? That guy literally just jumped a back flipped over the fucking top of me right there. So I need to see that again. I, I, I just need to see that again. That was so fucking weird. And the the funny thing is that the um the zombie guy or the little fucking guy did it straight away as well. This guy literally jumped over the top of me. Look look at that. <laughs> Fuck you. It's like oh really? That one was typical nanny. Wait. <laughs> look, look look at the little zombie guy though. He does it like pretty much instantly after after him though. Like, is there some kind of Disney ride there or something? What the fuck is that shit? Seriously, what the fuck? Um. <laughs> okay, Elliot, take care, mate. Take care. Thanks for the thanks for coming by. Appreciate it. Are there any other games for Xbox or PS4 similar to the Soul Series? Uh, yeah, you can get um Neo. Neo is a pretty good game. This is the Surge, which isn't that good. Like the best of all of them, I'd say is Neo. Um, the Surge is okay, Lords of the Fallen is a bit sluggish for me. So in Sanctuary is a 2D game, but it's really good. And um, Death Gambit just came out a few weeks ago, or about a week ago, which is another 2D game, which is really good as well. So in Sanctuary is amazing, yeah. I, I, like, if people have been asking me, like, what's better, So in Sanctuary or Death Gambit? They're both amazingly good, but I'm going to say that Certain Sanctuary is better than Death Gamma. It's just a bit. Yeah, I don't like Lords of the Fallen. Personally, I don't like Lords of the Fallen. Um, the Surge is okay. The Surge is actually from the same developers as Lords of the Fallen. But um, out of those games, I prefer Neo. I mean, Neo is still a Souls-like game, in my opinion. I mean, it is different, but I, I will consider it a Souls-like game. I need to get fucking good at this game and stop reading chat. Fuck my life. 
Go up left, mate. I mean, welcome to my main stream. Jesus Christ. I need to level up health as well. Maybe even change armor. We haven't really changed armor set since the start of the fucking year. Thank you, left, mate. Thanks for the support. Thanks for fucking coming here and showing your amazing support as per fucking usual. The big boy water bowl. <laughs> God damn it. Nero's okay. I like Nero's. I don't know. I, 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 I consider Neo a bit of a social like game. It's definitely different. Like, it's definitely different, but I, I consider it somewhat of a social like game. Though. Yeah, you're important. Well, it, it doesn't matter if we're stuck on this boss for the rest of history. How you doing, left boy? How you doing? How are you doing, lefty boy? Lefty boy, lefty boy. Big boy. <laughs> Matthew, it's okay. It's okay to be different, Matthew. I mean, it, it. We all know you're wrong, but it's okay to be different. You know what I'm saying, Matthew? Like, you don't have to be right to be cool. You don't have to be right to, to be different. Shut up, Matthew, mate. We are not even going to talk about Nick Mikolash right now. Where the fuck did this guy go, anyway? Where the hell is this bastard? I mean, this poor... Oh, there he is. Just waiting for me. Like a cool kid. Giant toad. That, that boss was amazing. Love that shit. What the fuck, dude? Right, I'm going to slap you so fucking much. I feel like the torture's moveset is like the worst possible thing for this type of enemy. I'm getting slapped on because I didn't level up no health at all. I'm getting insta-killed by pretty much everything and it's kind of annoying. Let's put all our stats in arcane, they said. The torch will do great, they said. I mean, the torch damage is okay. Our health is a piece of shit, though. Exactly, Matthew. Like, it's okay to have an opinion... Just know that you're wrong and know your opinion's wrong. That's the important thing. Know that God's opinion is always going to be right. Don't high five berries. Shut up, Matthew. Ma Matthew, mate. Matthew, Matthew, Matthew. Matthew, Matthew. You have so much to learn. But that's why you're watching my stream. That's why you're watching my stream. To learn. And that's that's why I'm proud of you, mate. I'm proud of you, Matthew. You know you're wrong and you're here to learn from God. And that's what matters in life. Knowing that you're wrong and coming to some way to learn. I'm proud of you, dude. I'm proud of you. I really am, dude. And I think this is the best place to learn. Like, we're so good at games. We know what we're talking about, kind of thing. I would never die to somebody like Mikolaj, you know what I mean? Like, Mikolaj is a nobody. Absolutely nobody. And that's why you're here, just to learn. Okay, boys. Chill the fuck out. Okay, boys, it's me and you now, motherfucker. Motherfucker. Look at that 46. Why am I only doing 46 damage? Is it because this guy's really resistant to fire or something? Or is there something I'm missing? This guy just this defense heavy every time. I haven't really noticed it, but I'm guessing that's the reason. To be honest, um, 12, I do not have a clue. I don't actually know what the C word is in Spanish. It's a word that must not be spoken, so. So that's probably why I don't know it. Probably doesn't even exist in Spanish, to be honest. Oh, fuck off. I mean, there's probably words that mean the same thing, but I don't think there's a direct translation to that word. Like, actually, I mean, in... I guess, like, if you don't want to call it a Souls-like, I would at least call it a Bloodborne-like game. 
Neo because it is probably faster paced, the dodging and all that does seem more bloodborne ish. Maybe not Dark Souls, but. Why does that guy just do two attacks like that? Why is there another zombie here? What the fuck did you got? There we go, boys. There we go. Let's go. Yo, ice. Uh, it's not too bad. Like, in all fairness, I thought this was going to be a lot harder. It's not actually too bad. Like, I don't... Like, I don't know about this specific boss. This specific boss seems to be quite a lot harder than the rest of them. It's like his defense is really, um... Really high compared to the other bosses. But, like, there's been bosses that have really been probably even easier than all of them. Uh, I don't know, do you find it funny, Carefree, mate? Do you find it funny that I got startled by a fucking other zombie? I don't think that's funny. There's no trifling matter, dude. Alright, we want him to go... What way do we want him to go? I want him to go this way, right? Will he make it? Will he make it? It's actually really hard to make. You can make it, though. It's actually, didn't he just do a really weird thing, actually? He just did a really weird thing. I don't think I've ever seen him go straight down here, right? Normally, he, like, I think every other time he goes up here and then to the right. That's so weird, actually. I don't think I've ever seen him do that. Cheese time. We're not, we're not going for cheesy. We're not, we're not going for cheesy, boys. We're not even going to do the, uh... <laughs> oh fuck, that actually did just interrupt his attack though, that was pretty fucking cool. Oh shit, I'm gonna die so badly here. God damn it. I need to... No, just let me... No. Oh no, I need to start, like, just get on... Oh fuck, I'm so far. God damn it, I hate this fucking piece of shit. It's like, if you don't get onto him, it's like, he's just dead. Is Miyazaki directing Sekido as well? I have not got a clue about that, too. Should have probably dashed towards them, actually, now you mention it, yeah. Oh, I hate that attack. It's quite annoying because, like, normally you just get onto him and it's done. He can't get away from you. Like, the torch is so short as well. Like, it's, it's the uh, range that the torch has got is pretty shit. It's kind of annoying as well. Or whatever. Whatever. No biggie. No biggie. We just drink out of our big boy water bottle and that's fine. Oh, is it really that? Okay. Okay, 12. Thanks for pointing it out. Now shut the fuck up. Tea time. Uh, okay, just send me one over, mate. That'll be good. Extra sugar for me, Aries, mate. Extra sugar. It's not actually a big water bottle, that's just like a standard fucking two litre water bottle. Is that not normal in your country? God damn it. In Spain that's like the most basic thing ever. Oh wait. Oh my god. It's probably not the most normal thing to just drink it straight out of the water bottle, I guess. I don't know. It's okay, it's okay, guys. Don't don't tell me about how I got to enjoy my water bottle. It's okay, 12, mate. I don't feel offended by that in any way possible. Don't say, yo, Jack, enjoy your water bottle, mate. Nah, it's okay. Who cares, right? I'm pretty sure it's basic all over the world. Just you guys, just weirdos. These guys have some incredible fucking health, and Jesus Christ, that guy's going mental. It's incredible how. Like, why does Mikalash have so high, such high defense? It's actually incredible. Is his armor set really just that good, or? This is like the fucking students one, right? Actually, like, in summer, I drink a lot of water. Like, probably even, like, three or four liters of water a day. I'm not joking. Like, it is just, in, like, if 
I don't normally, like, I'm not really a huge fan of water, but like it's just like 40 degrees over here and like it just feels like if you don't drink water you're gonna die. These blood pellets would work with the torch. It may do. That'd be really weird, but it could do. It makes sense in a really weird way. I guess. That'd be worth trying probably. Oh, Bleach? Yeah, Bleach is, is is pretty good as well. I love Bleach. Bleach is pretty big boyish. God, this guy is just so fucking insane with his stupid defense. I've got a feeling that my torch is going to break soon. It's been ages since we've... I don't think we've actually repaired, repaired the Hunter's Torch. I got a feeling that it's going to break in the worst possible moment. How much uh, durability does it have left? Uh, I, still, I fucking still got loads of durability. What the fuck, dude? I swear to God, every time he says the Majestic, I think it's a donation or something. It's just, it just, it almost feels like the game has copied my donation alert at this point. It's literally how I feel about this, and I may sue from software. Any objections about that? Would he go to the left again? I don't think I've ever seen that happen. Like last time he literally just went straight to the left and never seen that happen before. I was just gonna say it's so weird. Yo, Aratha, what's up, dude? Using the detailed wolf. How you doing? How you doing, Aratha? How you doing? Man? Oh, actually, we should have just dropped down behind him. We could have still done it, actually. Dude, where are you going? We're doing a bit more damage now. That's good. Don't know why we're doing a bit more damage. Where the fuck did he go? Did he actually go the other way? Oh my god, that is so... That, did you see the damage that just did to me? Jesus Christ, that's insane damage. Right, mate, where the hell are you now? I actually don't know where he was. Like, I'm guessing it was around here we could start to talk. I'll take that on the thing just in case. You're gonna get sued by Miklash? No, I'm gonna sue him. It sounds like my donation alert is the legit thing and the game's just copied my donation alert at this time, at this point. With the majestic thing. Do you think you're gonna get away with that, 12? Just because you're saying it in different languages? Not how this is working. Alright, if we jump this side. Ah, so close. So close. This is truly a cool game. That's what Carefree's review of Bloodborne would look like. This is truly a cool game. True, true game, true cool game. 10 out of 10. Well done. Still better than Val's uh, review for, um, for Persona. Right, just get on to him until he starts, so he doesn't start bullshit. Mate, I said. No. Fuck you, bitch. Don't make me fucking bullshit you, mate. Look at my damage is so shit against this piece of poo. I like doing like 46 damage per fucking hit. It's so shit. Fuck. That went pretty fucking smoothly. That one proof. Can I fucking get up and gain composure? Thank you. I don't think we've actually uh, leveled up stamina a single time this run, which is kind of noticeable at this point. Don't fucking do that, dude. You think you're fucking some karate god? You think you're fucking Bruce Lee or something? This guy's a fucking weirdo. Why has he got a helmet on? Or you can call that out. 
damage is so poo poo. Yo, 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 yo fucking combo in there. I still don't get how that's a parry. Like, why is that a parry? That does not count as a gun shot, you piece of fucking poo. Jesus Christ, that is annoying. It almost felt like that was destined there. That was fucking stupid. Oh my god. That was like destined to happen. Shut up, Twelve, you understand? Fuck all. Uh, looks like we're gonna have to go back to farm some nice fucking blood vials, which is clearly the best part of blood one. Uh, what's cheap? It's not cheap here. Humans as well. Uh, you can you can upgrade the the, the hunter's torch to plus ten. You can't upgrade the normal torch to plus ten, but you can the hunter's. Uh, I'm not sure what we're going on right now. We're going on plus eight. I think we're pretty close to getting it to plus ten. If we can't, oh sorry, plus nine anyway. If we can't already, that is. No, we're two chunks away from plus eight, nine. The damage, like this damage, is really random on the torch. Some bosses is amazing, but on other things like that, it's just. The average salary is 2500 Wait, not dollars, surely, right? There's no way we're talking about $2,500. I'm not sure what country you're in, but I'm guessing we're not talking about dollars. Here. Yeah, I know we've only got one blood vial, so that's why we're going to farm some blood vials. Just why we're going to this lovely area over here. Once again, forgot to equip this ship. If you get two thousand five hundred a month, and you you spend two hundred on a game, that's like what eight seven seven percent per game of your salary or something like that. Because if yeah, if it was two hundred fifty, it was probably about eight percent of your salary. I, I don't know. That's not actually too bad. Like I think over here in Spain, it's quite similar because like the average salary in Spain is one thousand euros, around about. And a game costs 60 to 70 euros, so maybe maybe a tiny bit more, maybe a tiny bit cheaper here, but not not too far off. Wait, euros? We're talking about euros? How can? Why? Why would you pay 200 euros to get a standard edition? Couldn't you just get it from another country? Couldn't you just make a PSN account? Like as an English PSN account, like from the UK, and just get it from the PSN store. Wouldn't that make things a lot simple? Do you think Dark Souls Two? Uh, I think it will be made. I'm not sure if it should be made yet. I think they will make it, and they should make it eventually, but probably not yet. Like the fact that they're not making it is because they're out of ideas and they don't want to rush it. It's probably a good thing that they're not making it. It probably shouldn't be made. But I think they all know when it should be made. You spent 20 euros for standard plus Bloodborne three weeks. Yeah, exactly. Like, I mean, I mean that. Wow, that's obviously a good deal. 20 euros actually. That's so fucking weird, though. So we're talking about like this average salary is 2,500 euros, which is actually even fucking insane. But games cost 200 euros. I don't know. Like, like, I'm not sure if that is expensive or not, though, if you think about it, though. Cause, like, in Spain, the average salary is 1,000, and a game costs 70. That's, like, 7% of your salary. And that's quite close. So I'm not sure. See, exactly. I, I knew Jester wasn't talking about euros. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. I thought Jester wasn't talking about euros, so. But even like, no matter what currency it's in, like if you got two thousand five hundred of something, you know, Pompa Rang some things for the sub. If you're getting two thousand five hundred or whatever, and you're using two hundred uh, for a game, it's around about eight percent or nine percent of your salary. 
which is quite expensive, I guess. I mean, over here in Spain, it's about 7% of your salary, I guess, if you... Which is still quite fucking stupid if you are, if, if you think about it. It's quite expensive. Um, actually, 12? No, I don't remember when sliced bread costs 60 fucking pounds. I don't know what um, currency Jester's talking about, but really, if you think about it, it doesn't actually matter. It's just a percent of whatever your monthly salary is. Yeah, you are 12. Shut up, Trillion, mate. I'm not sure what I'm talking about, but I probably... Shut up. Just, just be quiet, Trillion. Just be quiet. Guys, shut the fuck up. Jesus Christ. I know what I'm talking about. You guys, you're, you guys are the people that don't have a clue what you're talking about. Oh my god. I think it's always my fault, isn't it? It's always my fault. Where are we going? I think we're going there. Hunt that. That os Athoso driver literally sounds an an overdose or an an excess of uh, like Dravia, which in Sp in English is just like being annoyed. So it kind of makes sense. I guess. I do I don't have any pellets, do I? I don't think I got any pellets, right? Probably probably should have got some. We could have probably actually got some, but whatever. It would have been actually interesting. We we will try that just see if it was. The currency you're talking about is MYR. Don't actually know what currency that is, but. Alright, well, 12, you really are entertained by this, aren't you, mate? <clears throat> you really are entertained by looking for the C word in different languages, and you're, you're having the time of your life because you're finally saying the C word. Oh, Malaysian currency. Okay, that's interesting. Yeah, I guess we could get um, pellets from the inside, you're right. We would probably get rid of it. <laughs> you learn cur the amount of currencies that we've learned on this stream is insane. We've learned about oh my god, that is so annoying. We've learned about Dude, what the fuck is wrong with your people? Not about the people. I was about to say what the fuck's wrong with your currency, but then I just like that, that. You just seen that we missed two attacks and we literally fucking locked onto him, standing right beside him, and we literally can't fucking hit him with a torch. It's just because it's got one move set, which is kind of dumb considering it was like right beside him. How am I racist? Any way of supporting you that isn't money, right? Hey, you know, just simply watching the stream is amazing, dude. Honestly, simply watching, liking the stream is uh, more than I can ask for. Don't worry about it, dude. Don't worry about it. I'm clearly donating isn't the only way of supporting the stream. Just simply liking the stream and just just being in the chat, just keeping it active is more than enough. Watched. I I don't actually play play ads in the middle of the stream, you know. Fuck you, really. Probably one of the only streams that doesn't play ads in the middle. Of them. Yeah, sure. You may get an ad at the start if you join in at the start. You'll probably get an ad, but that's probably the only time you'll get an ad. I mean, I guess if you fancy watching the whole ad or whatever, that that'll probably help out a few cents or something. But that's already up to you. That doesn't. Really... So shut the fuck up, Trin. Trin, just go to bed. Definitely think it's about time you went to bed. Hopefully this guy won't do a backflip over the top of me and fucking backstab me. That'd be great. Cause you are carefree, mate. Cause you are. Like the thing is, like donations keep the stream alive. Like donations keep the stream existing. But like the chat and you guys in general make the stream what it is. If that makes sense. 
Like, so the simply just being here in the chat and liking the stream just makes the stream what it really is, makes the fun part of the stream. Yeah, sure, donating, like, keeps it a thing, keeps it existing. And this guy's gonna fucking fuck off. Somehow. But, like, both things are just as important, you know? Uh, I, yes, we will be getting Dragon Quest XI, yes, 100%. I'm not sure if we'll stream it or not, but I would 100% upload some of it to the 100% walkthrough other channel. So can you just get out the fucking door? Thanks. So that would be absolutely fantastic. Yeah. 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 It's banging. I don't get this game. I don't understand this fucking game. Like every time I look at the chat, there's some bullshit. Whatever the fuck that guy is, trying to kill me. Uh, he would have donated by a university. Is tough. Hey, that's that's fine. That's fine. Don't worry about it, dude. Donations are much appreciated, but obviously other things like likes on the stream and everything is just much appreciated. Okay, 12, take care, mate. Dream about the C word in every language that you've learned. You probably don't remember any of them. Take care. Thanks for coming by. <laughs> Goddamn. If you had to choose between us or $1,000, $1,000 easily, mate. Just joking, Hillary. Just joking. Choose, choose you, mate. Not even you guys. I choose you, Trump, because you're so special. It's Fallout 76 on the... Uh, it will be closer to release date, I guess. Probably, like, most games, like, I'm interested in going the goal. Like, I like to keep the wish list like, a monthly thing. Like, at the start of each month, I'll put, um... Or not, not necessarily at the start, but, like, I will... Most of the games that are on the wish list are always going to be games that come out the same month. So, like... Next month, I'll put on the wish list games that come out in uh, um, October or September or whatever. I know, Trump. I know, mate. Love you too, dude. That's really amazing. <sighs> Not getting triggered by this boss anymore. I, like, I love this boss. It's like one of, the, one of the easiest bosses on any fucking Souls game. And yet, it's the one that pisses me off the most sometimes. Some random shit on this boss. Like, it's never something legit that kills you on this one. It's always some random crap. Some say Cossum. Nobody fucking says Cossum. I know nobody, zero people that say Cossum. Plus, people that say Cossum instead of Cossum just weirdo. I love the torch though. It misses when you're literally touching them and you're locked on. Fucking fantastic weapon. I won't put all the games on the wish list until they're at least the same month though. This guy's going a bit mental. Can you stop dodging? Thanks. I would appreciate it if you used some stamina to do other things, mate. You probably don't have... Or you probably have infinite stamina by those things. Oh, fuck, dude. Alright, big boy. Let's fucking go, mate. I'm probably going to regret saying that very soon. Come on, this this boss is like a piece of cake kind of boss. <sighs> what do you do? Do you wait until he does attack? Don't attack? Sometimes he won't attack? Look, this is why I attack, and as soon as you press the attack button, he'll fucking attack you. Thanks for the sub, zombie. Which is probably zombie on a different account. I'm not sure. Maybe. Thanks for the zombie sub. Zombie sub. The damage on this torch is so shit for this boss. I don't get why. I don't know why it's so shit only for this boss, though. Like, for the rest of the bosses, the damage has been okay. Or pretty good, even. And for this boss, it's just poo poo. Maybe he's seen what I'm doing and he's just prepared himself for the torch. Unbelievable. Well, that, that 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 changed pretty quickly. Your opinion on me changed pretty quickly there, uh, Trump. Mate. It changed pretty fucking quickly. Somebody's probably subbed on 50 accounts. So. Another one. 
Another zombie, god damn it. Where the hell are these guys coming from? Anyway? Yes. I'm not sure if you guys call these guys zombies, but I call them zombies. So that... Oh, fuck. Man. Because, carefree. Because. God damn it, mate. If you don't go fuck yourself, I'm gonna go fuck yourself. If that makes any sense at all. Mate, I'm pretty sure you're at half health and you should be about dead. Yep, it sure, it sure seems seems like it lethal. Holy crap. Like, this guy's defense is mental high. I never really noticed it. I don't know, maybe it's... Oh, fuck. Probably because we're using this weapon or whatever, but I never really noticed how high and insane his defense really was. Right, actually, let's go down the other way. Thank you very much. It's okay, Carefree, mate. It's okay. We all know you're just jelly. It's okay, dude. There's nothing wrong with being jelly. Like, it's just it's just part of the human, you know? Being jelly is just part of being a human. There's nothing wrong with being jelly. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> exactly. You like sushi? I love sushi. Oh, wait, where, where, where am I? I'm in the wrong place. Uh, sushi is actually probably my favorite food. Asian food is my favorite food and sushi is fucking great. Absolutely love that shit. It's quite hard to get. Well, it's not hard to get around here, but it's kind of expensive around here. Not insanely expensive. No, yeah, it's, it's okay, Carefree. Like, we believe you. It's not, not like we don't believe you. Did two damage there with that full damage. Lovely, lovely. Pokey, pokey motherfucker. Alright, stop punching me. That would be absolutely fantastic. Yo, thanks. God, thank God Ares is back. I can now complete it. I can now just go for it. Thank fuck that Ares is back. Welcome back, Ares. How was that cup of tea and where the fuck is mine? You forgot something, Ares, mate. Oh shit. You can get rid of Twidian. Why would anybody want to get rid of Twidian? Twidian. Twidian is amazing. Twidian is like one of the best. Twidian is like a big boy around here. Well, at least he thinks so. Like, if, if this guy parries me in a really dodgy way, like last time, and fucking kills me, I'm just done. You had to drink tea without milk. That tea's not, like, that bad. I mean, with milk, it's like 50,000 times better, but even British tea without milk isn't too bad. They, they actually do British tea without milk at my McDonald's, which is completely random, but it's actually not too bad. My McDonald's probably does like 50,000 things more than every other McDonald's in the world, which is actually pretty fucking cool. They literally do British tea in Spain without milk, and it's like, okay, I'll take some of that. That wasn't too bad. Clearly better with milk, but you know, what are you going to do about it? Barbaric. <laughs> I, I, will, I will tell your opinion to McDonald's, um, just to may, we'll just call it barbaric. Yo, Anka, what's up, boy? Shut the fuck up, boy. Do you want me to say what I what I think about your songs? Do Do you want me to Do you want me to say? Oh wow, this guy's totally trying to be a Maluma fanboy, but I'm not. I'm not saying that, am I, Anka? I'm saying, yo, good good content, Anka, mate. Keep it up, dude. Keep on keep on singing. Shut the fuck up, mate. Yo, Kazak, what's up? Welcome. You want to beat Tridian? We don't have we don't have that. We don't we don't have poles to be Tridian. We don't do that around here. We're peaceful people around here, kind of, maybe. I'm I'm sure I'm sure yes, Anka, I'm sure yes, mate. Shut the fuck up. 
Guys, we're going to calm down and then we're going to breathe in and breathe out and have a nice cup of tea. Uh, Aries is making it today without the milk, so you guys can enjoy it a bit. Not full fledged, but you know. God, it's hot. It is so fucking hot around here, it's insane. Sweating, like this t-shirt isn't really this color by the way, I'm just, just, just saying that this t-shirt isn't this color. I don't know, Trump, what do you want me to do about it? Do you want me to slap him? Or what? What are we doing about it? Why are we why are we here with one with one vial, by the way? No errors. It probably wasn't the same t shirt, but shut the fuck up. Right, um, let's go and get some blood vials. Actually we should we should uh try and after this, we should try and finish upgrading the torch to plus 10. Should be kind of nice. Let's get a big boy drink. Yeah, this t-shirt was actually white last stream. Good job, good job, Aries, man. I'm glad you noticed what I mean. I just spilled tea without milk on it. Uh, it depends what tea. Like, there's a lot of teas that are nice without milk. Like I said, even British tea without milk is okay. But there, there are a lot of other teas without milk that are okay. I mean, most teas. Like, a lot of the, like, more Eastern type teas are pretty much supposed to be drunk without milk anyway. Like, it's only British tea. I mean, it's not only British tea. It's meant to be drunk with milk. But, like, most of the Eastern teas are kind of meant to be drunk without milk anyway. Though they are pretty good, like I, I like even green tea. Green tea is nice with or without milk. Yo, Josh, what's up? It's okay, Josh. It's not too bad. We're not strong. We're not. We're not actually. This, this challenge run isn't making us struggle as much as like a lot of the other past ones, like fist only on um Dark Souls. It's actually not a bad one. Could you want a pole? Could you want a pole trillion? I think a, I think a battle in between Tridian and um, Trump on poll would literally have zero vote, votes on it because you guys, lo everybody loves you guys. God damn, it's so hot. That guy needs to learn to drive, by the way. God damn it. Well, he probably paid good money to go in that fucking carriage. God damn it, it's so hot in this room, it is insane. Yo, AZ, 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 what's up? Welcome to the stream, how are you doing? How do you end this run in like a do? Uh, actually, my brother took about three or four runs to do this, Ankel, so shut the fuck up, dude. Thank you. Poor little Ankel. Poor little Ankel, it's just a bit jelly. It's okay, Ankel, man, it's okay. Not everybody is as cool as me, and I really wouldn't start getting depressed over it, to be honest, because, like, it's never going to happen. Right, so what we're going to do next is we're going to go back. Before fighting the wet nurse, we are going to, um, we're going to level up the weapon, hopefully, to max, plus 10. I know, AZ, I know. I mean, it's, it's such a luxury to see me. To see God himself at work. I'm glad somebody's um, actually thankful for it. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge, Angel. Thank me for streaming, motherfucker. Tridian, what the fuck are you talking about? Hibiscus tea is really good as well. I don't think I've ever tried that. Like, I've tried quite a lot of teas. I've tried British tea, obviously, with and without milk. Green tea, with and without milk. Uh, matcha tea, which is pretty nice. Uh, I've tried this, um, I, I think this is like this Arab tea that was called Winter Dreams, which is like an almond tea, and that was pretty nice as well. And I've probably tried other ones that I just really random ones in like, like Arab type places. And to be honest, like most of them are pretty good. The only type of tea that I don't really like is mint. I just don't like mint at all. But I, I think, like, as long as it's not a mint tea, I probably like most of them. It's gonna get these chunkios that should um, let us level it up. 
Yo, Dark Souls, what's up? Open. <laughs> you made Hank suicide in Detroit. How dare he? Oh shit. Hank's really cool, to be honest. Um, how the fuck are we? Uh, we've actually been doing quite well. Like, we didn't stream yesterday because it's Saturday, but today we've actually made some good progress. Alright, Anchor, mate. Alright, we'll, we'll, I'll take that as a as a compliment. Just there, kind of guy. Yeah, I know. I, I was there most of the time in his uh, Detroit stream. <laughs> it's like... Everybody doesn't... Like, everybody loves Hank. Well, I don't think everybody loves Hank. I think everybody loves the... the uh, the relationship that Hank can have with Connor. I think that's why everybody likes Hank. I think that relationship is one of the best in personal to me. Oh. You've never noticed those stones? Oh uh, what, you mean the um the chunks? The ones behind there? They're quite well hidden. They're quite well hidden. Let's go and get the uh like the, the blood rock though. Which is what we're missing to get it plus ten. Okay, Anchor mate. All right, I, th I think you've said enough. You've you've said enough, Anchor mate. That's good. Uh, we haven't done Ludwig yet. We we will try. I'm not like like I said. I won't go and guarantee anything on the DLCs, but I will try and do the DLC. I uh, would definitely not try and now you think of it. We're not trying. Um. Lawrence, because Lawrence is extremely resistant to fire, and not only is it a really tough boss, but with a torch and being resistant to fire, I don't think we'll even attempt Lawrence because that's just a no no. But apart from Lawrence, we may, like, at least try and kill Ludwig and Cos. We'll see. Thanks for all the support, guys, by the way. Thinking, saying that how good I am and all that bullshit. What the fuck up, guys? You have no clue what you're even talking about. Oh, dear. Let's go and get the rock. I don't think, like, now you think about it. I know it's a bit late, but I don't think you can enchant the torch with um, gemstones. I don't think so, anyway. Right, uh, let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, we've got enough of these things, so we just get out of here with a hunter's mark. I know, I know, Trump. I know, mate. I can tell. Yo, vape, what's up, dude? Welcome back, big boy. Big boy vape. I know you're not a sponsor anymore, vape, but I will call you a big boy because you've been a sponsor. That's good enough. nothing less obviously so that's that's why you're watching this content for the best content we we don't want any of that that like low class shit content we're here for the luxury content you know what i'm talking about yo ellis what's up dude welcome to the stream how you doing right uh let's level up level up it's okay, vape. You've done more than enough, dude. The the month you was a sponsor was clearly more than enough. Right, um, fortify weapon. We should have enough to go all the way to plus ten. I uh, just confirmed we can't have blood gems now. Okay, can't have blood gems on a torch. That sucks. That sucks. So, um, go up, I guess. Kind of really need a lot more health. Uh, it, it's going okay. It's not going too bad. I'm not sure how much damage this is going to do. We're, we're about to find out on the on the wet nurse. It's been ages since we've uh, fought the wet nurse, so we're probably going to get um, destroyed. I'm not going to lie. <sighs> do we? I don't know. It just feels such a waste. No, let's no. I'm not going to buy buy blood vials. We already said this at the start. I'm not going to waste any souls on blood vials. All going into arcane until it gets to 40. What I am going to do is go in and uh, farm a few before the wet nurse because chances are we're going to die a few times. So it's always good to have some. Uh, what level are we? We're around about level 50, I think, approximately. Approximately level 50. 
Like, you know, you could just love both of this and end of story, just saying. It's okay, vape, dude. Don't, don't worry about it, vape. Don't worry about it. I appreciate the sponsor you was. Go and farm the farms. I mean, to be honest, we could probably even try and take on Ludwig at this point because we're probably not going to get much better. But uh, we want to kind of do it in, in some kind of an order. So before fighting Gurnham and all that, we will go and do the DLC. Or at least try and do the DLC. Ankel, nobody wants to fucking look at you, mate. And if they do look at you, it's probably for different reasons than you think it is. Just pointing it out, mate. Just pointing it out. You're from Finland? Uh, I live in Spain. I'm from the UK, but I live in Spain. I'd, I'd take a good wild guess, Trump, mate. Just take a mass, like, just don't even think about it. Try and take a wild, wild, wild guess. Just take the wildest guess that you've ever fucking seen in your life. I wonder if it's a wrenchman. Impossible, right? Impossible. It, it does, it just doesn't look like it, does it? Doesn't look possible. Doesn't look possible, does it? Come on, dude. That, that sounds like a pretty solid wild guess, that one does, Trump. Sounds like the solidest of the solid guess. Uh, I don't know when I can make. Shut the fuck up. One, like, either tomorrow or the day after, I am thinking about getting a haircut, and then you're not going to have any fucking thing to say tomorrow, are you, Ankham? I'm British. Who cares? I'm from the UK. I am the UK. I am the United Kingdom and the United Kingdom is me. That sounds British as fuck. That sounds like a true Brit. Proud as fuck. Poor little one. Poor little boy. Poor little boy. At least I've got a brain to be controlled over. Jesus Christ. It's okay, I'm coming. don't worry about it. Just because you like reggaeton doesn't mean that you don't have a brain. Maybe slightly little than the rest of them, but you still have a little brain with all that lovely fucking beautiful music in it. Jesus Christ. Let's just go in. The United Kingdom of America. Uh, Bloodborne looks so like we actually said this yesterday like some of the buildings and, and stuff on Bloodborne Like how well and detailed they are is insane like it literally said the exact same thing yesterday about Dark Souls 3 and Bloodborne Oh uh, you go to the Finland army service cool good luck with that good luck God damn it. I don't know, Trump, mate. I think she's way out of your league, just saying. Like, don't take it as offense, but... I, I think she's way out of your league, dude. Just saying. Right, um... Let's go, I guess. Let's just go. I wonder if we'll be able to beat this boss today. We will try our best. Wet Nurse is one of those really random boss. Like, actually, the first time I ever fought Wet Nurse, I killed her the first go. I thought, wow, that was an easy boss. But apparently, it was because she never did, like, the ghost attack. And then next time, I had a bit of trouble on her. I don't know, Ankel, mate. It's time to find out, boy. It's time to find out, Ankel, mate. It's time to find out. That's how we do things over here. Fencing. With a torch. Poke people with torches, apparently. Alright, let's go, white nurse. 11 months army service. It's quite a long time, actually. 
I, I, I'm starting to lose track of what you guys are talking about. Spe specifically the Trump conversation. That's the conversation that's kind of just getting out of my league right now. God damn it. Oh, we didn't trade our insight for fucking... Oh, God, for the bone thingy. That's pretty good. That's pretty neat. God damn it. That didn't go too well. That really didn't go too well. Thanks for that, Ankel, mate. Thanks for the confidence boost. Thanks for the confidence boost, Ankel, mate. Shut the fuck up. Jesus Christ. Ah, oh, poor little Ankel. It's a poor little boy. Do have to feel sorry for him a little bit. It's okay, it won't happen again, guys. Except it may. I, I, to be honest, I wasn't expecting him to insta-kill me. That's the big problemos around here. Maybe we should put on something better. Physical defense is better with that, what about? Fire. This guy doesn't use any, I don't know really what's best to use. We don't really have many options, so I guess we just keep this one. Wasn't expecting an insta-kill, to be honest. Yes, T7, everybody is absolutely behaving perfectly. Can you not see the lovely community we've got here, T7, mate? Obviously, everybody loves being behaved. Look at that, fucking damage isn't too bad. Like, this this, this thing has a lot of health, but it's still good damage. I will say whatever the fuck I want, Ares. I will say if I want to say I'm from the from Earth, I will say I'm from Earth. The far right and the far left and the open left and the close left and the close right and all that bullshit. It's getting kind of out. Huh? You're buying you're buying the pug mug. That sounds like one of the best ideas I have ever heard all day long. I'm not like I'm not saying it just because it's my merch or anything because it's to do with me or something like that. I'm just saying that T7 has some really good ideas, guys. I do recommend following his ideas. Just saying. Just just a general idea, you know, just laying it out there. By the way, I do have a merch store, just saying. I am the culture. How are you going to integrate me in the culture when I am the culture? I mean, if you if you take an eleven, that's that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Okay, T seven, take care, mate. Good, you watching out. Also merch, guys. You want a pug mug? You want to drink your milk from a real pug mug? You want to you want to get that coffee to taste proper? You want that proper coffee to prove? Nobody is buying you a pig mug, Donald. Nobody. You need to buy it yourself. Uh, you do actually get discounts if you've donated to the channel. Like if you donate to a channel, if if you donate to the channel through the link in the description, you do actually get a bit of a discount on the. On the um, merch, if I'm not mistaken. I'm not sure if it depends how much you donate or not. Take care, T7. Thanks for showing by, dude. Really do appreciate it. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Dude, dude, no. So unfair. That needs to be a command. What does that do? What do you want that command to do? Just automatically hack into your bank account and donate it. That sounds like a good idea. Yo, Braulio, what's up, dude? Welcome to the stream. Welcome back. How are you doing?
I know, Brodio. I know, mate. I know. I know. I know. I'm glad you pointed it out, though. Donated you my livelihood. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not actually sure, like, if it has to be now. Like, I'm not actually sure how the discounts work. But a lot of people said, like, oh, I've donated and it's telling me that I can get a discount on one of the merches or something like that. I'm not sure how it works, though, to be honest. Sorry, Uncle, mate. Sorry for lying, even though I didn't. You wanna go to officer? I'm sure you can, mate. I'm sure you can. Just keep just keep doing what you're doing and I'm sure you will get to officer. Dude. You can do it. Oh you just playing you playing Bloodborne? Good luck. Good luck, mate. Good luck, dude. Good luck. This torch is not a bad weapon. Like I thought like I mean obviously the torch only is a challenge run, but it's not horrible. It's not the best weapon in the world, but still. That attack is kind of a nine. Because you just can't fuck you kind of thing. I think the only big mistake I've made this run is that I haven't up, uh, upgraded um, stamina a single time. Like if it wasn't for that, I think we'd probably have a better chance. Probably have a little bit of a better chance. I, I'm sure you would, Anko. I'm sure you would. I'm sure you would do. I'd like to at least beat this boss before going to bed. Need to beat this boss before going to bed, guys, by the way. Very important. I, I got what you're saying. I got what you're saying, Ellis. Ellis, I got what you're saying. Uh, that's pretty. That's like that's pretty fucking high. But I'm sure you can do it. I'm sure you can do it. Come on, this boss is quite easily done. Some random fucking ass attacks, though. Sometimes, seriously. And the the annoying thing about the torch is you don't get health back from rally damage. Like, it's really one of the things that pisses me off with the torch. I don't see why it doesn't. I don't see how the fuck that insta kills you, though. It's okay. Not going crazy or anything like that. I just you know how we have. It's almost 6 a.m. Holy shit, dude. I mean, we have been streaming for three hours, but I would like to at least attempt this guy a few more times before going to bed. Six a.m. is pretty fucking Jesus Christ. Yeah, you hear a baby crying because this is the wet nurse of the baby practically and this woman just here is basically her mother as you can see not had the best experience with her um baby southeast asia oh yeah you said uh, malaysia right i'm not mistaken you well i mean the currency is from malaysia so i'm guessing you're from malaysia that is like a long way away so Makes sense, I guess. 6 a.m., that is insane, dude. 6 a.m. But hey, what what better way to spend your early morning 6 a.m. than watching this amazing stream, right? Am I right, Justin? KFC. KFC is so healthy, isn't it? Uh, we've been streaming for about three hours today. Or do you mean how long we've been streaming in a lifetime? About a year and a bit, if that's the question. But I think you mean how long we've been streaming today. We've been streaming about three hours. Remember, if you're new, uh, you can join my Discord server. I always let you guys know when I'm going live on the Discord server. Yo, Steven, what's up? Daniel, good to see you guys. 
Torch only isn't too bad. It isn't actually the worst one we've done by, by far. The damage is okay against certain bosses. There's only two or three things that's really bad about this. It's only got one attack and that you don't get um, healing from rally damage. Like, they're two bad things, but like, the damage isn't horrible. Especially considering, like, the Hunter's Torch, you can level it up to R plus 10. That makes you sad. Yeah, like, that's why I like to tell you guys through Discord. Because um, on YouTube, even if you've got the bell notification thing on, it doesn't work most of the time. Like, the insane amount of people that complain about that is insane to me. It's okay. It's, it's okay, Steven. Like, everybody has a hard time with this game at the start. It's probably just because, like, once you've played it a certain amount, it just doesn't seem too bad. But trust me, everybody has a hard time on this game at the start. Anyway. This is lasting way longer than I thought it was going to last. There we go. Mate. There you are. I don't think she even seen me. Like she, she was just as confused as me. It's like, where the fuck did he go? It's like, I'm pretty sure he was over there. He teleported a random place. Don't do that, mate. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do you want to do it again? Or are you happy with two times? Uh, motherfucker. Uh oh. That was so fucking close. Just, like, it's so annoying that we didn't level up any type of stamina. Like I don't think we put a single level into stamina and it's kind of so noticeable. It wasn't really noticeable until like a few bosses ago. But it is getting quite noticeable this late game. I think there's only one attack that can insta kill me. Maybe maybe that one can as well, I'm not sure. It's a cool looking boss though, in fact. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh my god, that was so close. Probably best to just stick to her back in all fairness, but. Oh, no way she's doing it again. So annoying. I'm not annoying because it's, like, gonna probably kill me or not. It's just annoying because it takes so fucking long to get over with. Donald Trump here. Yeah, because that's totally the real Donald Trump. That is 100% legit Donald Trump. This attack just lasts so fucking long, it's just annoying. Wait, oh, yeah, it's over, fine. Dude, I just feel like this boss is just wasting so much time right now, it's insane. The real one. <laughs> That'd be so fucking hilarious. Like, oh, it really is the real one. Easy GG. Easy fucking GG. I do, like, I think before ending the stream, we'll have a few goes on Ludwig, like a very few goes on Ludwig. Can I 
I hate this. It takes so fucking long. Thank you. Thank you very much. Third umbilical cord. Probably won't be facing the moon presence, by the way. What I will do is go and try Ludwig one or two times. Just, just try. Because we will probably be heading off very soon, but I would like to try Ludwig. <clears throat> level up. Really all we can do now is level up. Uh, also, I will... Um, I will spend my insight to get... Uh, like, we don't actually know if this is going to work or not, the, uh, the bone thing. Can we even get... Can we not actually get them yet? I thought we could. I thought we could, but apparently we can't. Is it because we haven't done a certain thing or something? Ah, uh, whatever, who cares. Though I am going to get rid of all my insight just because, just in case it makes the boss a bit easier in some stupid way. Um... Like, I'm in the eyeballs. Fuck it. Got some of those. Good over the eyeballs. What is missing numbers of X plus equals minus 19? That can't be that hard, right? Um, that would be... Minus 100 and something right if it was minus 100 it would be minus 177 so it would be minus no what am I talking about it would be minus 117 so it's probably minus 116 right minus 116 plus 17 would be minus 99 right fucking mathematician probably maybe not I don't know Right. Anyway, we'll, we'll try. Um, we'll try at Ludwig. Uh, this isn't a secret boss. This is uh the DLC, DLC boss, DLC boss. That cooking school paid off. Showed me mathematics. Not that. This arena, the the um, the OST for this boss, specifically second phase, is fucking amazing. Probably gonna have a very hard time on this boss. Damage is fucking good though. I still can't get over how good the damage is. I wish I wish it was very cold over here. Like over here in Spain right now in summer, it's a, it's um 40 degrees, 40 degrees, and even in winter like it's probably only about 20 degrees. I wish it was a bit colder in summer. Like, wind is fine. We like, he is weak to fire, I can tell. It's pretty good. Probably dead though, anyway, but... Like, it's not too bad. It doesn't seem too bad, actually, to be honest. Like, you can clearly tell he's weak to fire. Which is okay, definitely. That's pretty... That's pretty neat. That's pretty cool. Right, I hope one more go before heading off to bed. Just to... Just to prove that we're cool, kid. <clears throat> So to talk about currencies and teas, and now we're talking about math. This stream is gold. That's nothing, mate. That's nothing. No, normally we just talk about um, food every fucking day. <laughs> normally somebody starts talking about pizza, and then everybody starts talking about pizza. So that's pretty good. Shy, sure, sure you. You have soft skin. Why is this having a conversation like Trump, mate? Just talk about me. You guys are not talking about me enough today. You guys need to talk about me. It's all about me. You guys are starting to forget about me and talking about yourselves. Yourselves aren't really that important compared to me. Just saying. That was pretty fucking good dodge. Job. I keep forgetting that we're not doing rally damage and I need it here. Rally damage is so good on Bloodborne. Especially for this kind of boss. You normally know, you get hit by this boss and then just keep... Oh my god. Yo, what's up? Okay. Oh my god. Right, we'll continue with this tomorrow, like I said. I just wanted to have one or two goes at Ludwig just to see what awaits us for tomorrow, but it doesn't actually look too bad. So, um... We'll continue with this tomorrow, and, uh...
oh, I'm so tired. I'm going to have a fucking shower and go to bed, probably after some dinner. So thanks ever so much for watching, guys. Thanks to T7 and Shinobi for the donations. Really do appreciate the uh, support on the channel. You guys really do keep it alive. And, um, yeah, we'll be around same time tomorrow night. Anybody new, go and check out the Discord server in the description. I always let you, um... I always let you guys know when we're about to go live, and, um, yeah, we will see you tomorrow. Take care.